plan. Hmm. If you feel trouble, wild and wild, don't need violent and hit you. Eight thousand. Wait a minute, hold that style, it's style. Damn, goddamn Billy Jack, we still riding. Tires flat, I hear them sirens, sea shots flying. So we driving fire back if they ain't vibing. Lie with that, got me dressed up in all black. What up? Hood up, and I see them haters try to run with us. They gon' need inhalers. Gotta breathe them hard, just like the Vader players. Grab your respirators, night invaders get like sabered. Mass on for the shooters, move like trash to bed intruder. Got that Glock and got them woofers, just press play, I'll keep it moving. Who is Knox? Who you damn fools? Keep it fresh like canned food. There ain't nothing we can't do, so tune into that damn kill. Yeah. It was never, ever a game. I'm out. Hey, what's going on everyone? It's Dan here guys. I want to welcome you to yet another edition of WWE 2K and WWE 2K 23. We're going to be jumping into the My Rise today, at least the first of, of two uh, different storylines. Uh, they've separated this year into, uh, instead of kind of having a more free range option, kind of like you did last time, they're pretty interchangeable from face to heel turns. You know, they had missions exclusive to each one. They still have something like that, but the difference is, is there's going to be a certain storyline for both male and female uh, wrestlers, depending which one you pick. The male uh, storyline is called The Lock, and the female storyline is called The Legacy. So we're starting off with The Lock, and we're going to go through it. Now, apparently, now I always take these, these numbers and you know with a grain of salt, but apparently there's 1,000 matches in this my rise mode and i'm assuming that's kind of, that's probably across both uh both storylines and apparently there's 50 hours of gameplay across the my rise that's the word on the street i don't know because if i remember correctly um they actually said the exact same thing about 2k22's my career and i ended up being able to beat it in like like 100 percent as much as i possibly have could given the circumstances um Jeez, I don't even remember what it was, but it wasn't that much. It was like maybe 12 hours or something like that. Maybe a little more than that. Maybe Okay, maybe not. Maybe it was like 20 hours. But either way, it wasn't what they said it was. So uh, we'll see what happens. But if it is that long, that's awesome. Because as you guys know, I absolutely love the My Career Modes uh, for WWE 2K. It's kind of one of the major series I've been known for over the years. So we are here and we are ready to rock and roll with WWE 2K23. Uh, I saw a few people asking me already. Um, and we are jumping in to this, but we're also going to be doing the showcase mode. Um, I, I do the showcase mode every time. I noticed there was some people mentioning, um, that they, you know, you're, there's a copyright issue, but it's one of those things where I have to just skip the cutscenes, like not the cutscenes, but they're act, they use real in, or sorry, like real uh, footage from like a, an event, various events. So unfortunately we have to skip right to gameplay. You could still do it, but it's it's just it, unfortunately it's gonna be a little bit broken up but we'll be doing that once we're done both my rise storylines so just keep that in mind so thank you guys for coming hope you're ready to rock and roll with some wwe 2k 23 my rise debut if you are make sure you're leaving a like on the stream and of course don't forget to say what's up in the chat so i know you're with us as well okay let's go through the chat we'll say our lows and we will jump right in all right what's up no cap what's up ricky hey ben uh what's up alex Alex, excuse me. Sorry, I misread that. <laughs> oh, what up, Sam? Hey, Mickey. Uh, what's up, Christian? Hey, Jaden. Hey, Brian. What up, Infamous? How's it going, Therese? What's up, Cosmic? Hey, Jet. Hey, Tim. How's it going? What up, Staley? What's up, Rob? Hey, Gwanlock. What's good? What up, Matt? Hey, Silver. Uh, what's up, Levi? Uh, uh, sorry, where are we leaving here? Disney, not sure if I got you. What's going on? Uh, what's up, Trey? Uh, what's up, Matt? Ricky, thank you for rejoining the membership program. I also saw that. Uh, sorry, I'll get to it in a second. Uh, what's up, Trey, Brendan, Tyler? What's good? Hey, John. Uh, what's up, Zach? What's up, Tito, Eileen, T. Roy? How's it going? Sarah, of course. Thank you so much for being a member once again for another month at that ultimate tier. Much appreciated. Uh, oh, geez, it jumped. Let's see. Denise, unless you actually want it to be D-nice. 
It depends. <laughs> we all, we get that. We get that. What up, Samil? Uh, what up, Trevor? Hey, Yasid. What's good, Eldred? Uh, what's up, Mac? Michael P., what's going on? Uh, sorry, I'm just trying to catch up here. Uh, Kurdish, what's good? Hey, Alf. Alif, excuse me, not Alf. Uh, let's see. What up, JM? How you doing? What's up, Kevin? Smitty? Sorry, guys. Just trying to get through it. What up, Will? Suvo, what's good? Mike? Welcome, welcome. Thank you guys very much for being here. And obviously, thank you guys to the continued support through the membership program. We are working towards 400 members once again. Let's see if we can get there by the end of the stream. You can join that by the link in the description. There's a join button below the video as well. Uh, and also, uh, you can gift the memberships right next to chat, dollar sign icon. Uh, you can gift anywhere from 1 to 50 members to people. You have to be on desktop or Android phone for that. Unfortunately, iPhone is still in the works. Anyway, without any further ado, guys, let's jump right in to my rise. Here we go. So all the music is cut. So, yeah. I'll have to read it then. It's weird that this is completely muted. Standing backstage in front of a single curtain, the only thing that separates you from the WWE Universe in the moment that will change your life forever, your WWE debut. I have creator save mode on, so they, they just mix them. For some, it means stepping in front of the crowd that immediately erupts and chants your name. And then expectations placed upon you before you even step foot in the ring. I wonder if I should skip this, but how does it mean trying to make the best impression to those who have no idea who you are? Some will find a clear path to the top, while others may take a step, few steps back before they figure out how to move forward. Because how you start doesn't always determine how you finish, who you eventually align with. Because how you start doesn't always determine... Oh, wait, did I read that already? <laughs> you ultimately discover who you really are. After that moment, the choices you make could send your career in different directions and have the potential to change the makeup of WWE Universe forever. So essentially it's saying, like, you might start off as a face, excited to be here, and it's like, I'm going to flip it and, you know, turn it around. Everyone's rise to WWE is different. But it all starts the same way. Standing backstage in front of a single curtain. What happens next is up to you. All right, well, let's figure it out. It's time. Time to get the sauce. All right, welcome to My Rise. Between the lock and the legacy My Rise stories, you have 10 save slots available. Both the lock and legacy have pivotal choices that can send you down distinct pathways. Try playing each, multiple, each story multiple times to experience different outcomes. That's interesting. Oh, snap. Let's go. Let's go. Right off the bat. Sarah is kicking things off with 50 gifted members once again. Sarah, you're an absolute legend. Holy hell. So, what, dude, that means we're close to 450. Just like that. We are almost at the new emoji. Oh, man. Well, I got to get something going. We're close then. What does that mean? We're like, I think, 22 away? Oh, my. Anyway, let's start this up. Hold on, the legacy. Making your. I, I'm pretty sure this is female, right? Making your WWE debut has some extra challenges when your aunt is a beloved WWE Legend Hall of Famer. Will you leverage your family legacy to rise to the top? Or look, I'll have to, that's going to be annoying, so I'm going to have to turn off the, the alert. But thank you very much, Sarah. I appreciate it. Uh, anyway, uh, will you leverage your family legacy to rise to the top or look for to chart your own path in WWE? Unless, of course, it doesn't matter. Hold on. Expectations are high. Uh, when you debut as the next big thing and a future world champion, but are you a lock to live up to all the hype or will you fall short of high stakes in world WWE? Wait a minute. Does it matter? Like, are, like, can you be either? I thought it was gender specific. Well, I want to double check. They're not being very straightforward with this. Let's see. Um, is the, I, I thought that there was, I was going to do the, Lock is okay. That's what I thought. Okay, we're gonna start with male, so we're gonna do the lock first, then and like legacy second. They should specify. He's the next big thing. He's been yes, he is going. He he's been a dominant force around the world. He's a future world champion. He can't miss. He's can't miss. He's the main event. He's a lock. I don't know why. I don't understand why. Like, I am the lock. So are we, we going to be able to hear anything at all in this? 
Or is it just going to be like that the whole time? All right, so now we got to actually create our superstar. All right, so normally I like to go with a high flyer for my my male. I can't remember. I remember you can't actually change your weight class. We'll do light heavyweight. That's kind of a good balance as a high flyer. Yes. I remember. Oh, right. They gave you default. Well, I think we're going to end up doing our own. I think, I think we got to bring back Daddy Dan Q for this, guys, huh? <laughs> they don't have anything that we have. If we're gonna, if we're gonna stick, if we're gonna stick to it, it can, these don't mix. I like that they give you some like predetermined ones at least, so that you can kind of, you know, skin. That looks terrible. I think it's supposed to be hockey, but it's not very good. <laughs> oh man, guys, I hope you're ready for the lols because that's what we're all about here. The entertainer. What's with the little bit of hair he's got on the side? That's kind of weird looking. Oh, my. Isn't this just the Velveteen Dream right here? That's what that looks like. I think that's what it's style. Whatever happened to that dude? He probably got released. Most people, most superstars get released. All right, we're going to ignore that. Unless I just go with the wrestling. Is there any? Are the, nah, they're not that good. We'll just go with current, and then we'll modify it, okay? That's what we do. Wait, didn't, didn't he get in some trouble? You know what I mean? Okay, how do you change his appearance? Has that come up yet? Hold on. Go back for a second. Wasn't there like an information? Um, I thought there was like one where you... Maybe not. Maybe I didn't miss anything. Camera options. Oh, I see. Oh, never mind. That seems like a weird thing to do. That, yeah, I, I remember about the underage thing. I remember that. That was like, I remember it was like, oop, he signed, sealed, delivered his, his, uh, his fate there. <laughs> it's game over for him, I'm afraid. All right. Well, anyways, uh, let's go select this persona. Let's start off the name. I can't remember if I just did it like this or not. Oh, Jesus. It's there again. Oops. Sarah's dropping another 20. Let's go. What is that now? Hold on. I'm going to open up my thing. I think we might be two away. Let me just check. Hang tight, guys. I was not expect. Oops. I was not expecting to get this many. I got It looks, I think, though, like I'll have to, I have to get a new emoji made. Look, just like that. As long as some don't expire and before I can get it out. Let's see. 449. We are one away from that. From me being able to give you an emoji. That's crazy. <laughs> Thank you so much, Sarah. You're a legend. Are you sure this mode isn't about you? <laughs> oh, wait. Two lines. Oh, wait. Go back. Backspace. All right. No, stop doing that. Oh, my God. Ugh. Sorry, guys. I'm trying to shift it oh it's left stick that's why daniel daniel <laughs> remember we went through all the things all right use this name for your abbreviated name no wait a minute that's not what we want that's not what i did sorry i couldn't remember if i did my actual name or if i did this there you go yes Entrance name, social account name, presentation name. Oh, guys, we already know. <laughs> guys, we already know what it is. <laughs> it's so much better, trust me. I mean, I guess I could do my... I have my full name here, but it's funnier to do it this way. We already know. Daddy Dan is back. All right, hometown. Let's see if... The, okay, the last... I don't know how many uh, WWEs they've never had a, a variety for me. So, let's go Canada land. Yep, it's... Oh, wait, they have Alberta, but it's... Yeah, it's just going to be Calgary. 
that's the only one. They've only, they've never changed it. So usually I just say none because I don't want to be from Calgary. I'd rather tie my eyelids to my nutsack. <laughs> I'm just kidding. <laughs> we'll just do none. None, none. Just, they'll just say from Canada. It's simpler that way. Oh, uh, what up, Smoke? If you actually put the lock. Oh, yeah. All right, the face. All right, face template. We always start with the templates. I'm going to try and simulate one we've, we used previous years. His face looks smaller than his head. They re I don't think they change much for this kind of stuff. I wonder if they're actually going to ever put a face scan. I remember they tried that, but it really all it was was you took a picture of yourself. Do you guys remember that? You took a picture of yourself, <clears throat> and um, they, you just slapped it over the character model. That's it there. That's actually it. That is it. I know it doesn't look like it, but that's it. Face texture. Is this just how pale he looks? Oh my god, that dude, check to see if he's still breathing. See, that's too yellow. Your boy's a bit pale. Your boy's a pale, pale bitch. Uh, facial parts. No, teeth. Teeth, you got, they got, you can make, like, look at all these gaps. Oh my god, can you imagine if you came down the, like, the ramp looking like this? There are people who actually do this shit to their own teeth, by the way. You can actually do that to your teeth. What was that one dude's name, that rapper? He did the exact same thing. He actually made his teeth that way. It was so messed up. See, and the height thing. That Okay, see what I mean? Like, the height is wrong. I, I know you could change your height, but they hit it last time. Oh, face photo capture. So they do have that. Yeah, see, it's the same thing. So they haven't changed that for years. Um, I'll just accept it for now. I think it's under body, right? I'm pretty sure. Okay, so body type. Yeah, this is how you change the height and the weight. Okay, so the weight. Oh, let's see. Okay, six foot. There you go. Let's be honest, I'm on the shorter end of six feet. I'm like in between these two. If I had a height, I'm like... Tell you what, let's just do the. Let's just do that one. Okay, let's just take a look at the weight. How much would you weigh as a light heavyweight at six feet? Honestly, I think that's a fair weightage. Let's say 220, maybe. I'd say that's a reasonable... But hold on, it won't actually let me change it, will it? Oh, I actually have to do this. I see. Oh, and you can do the thin. Oh, my God, dude. <laughs> he looks like an alien. <laughs> oh. Let's see the medium build. I prefer like a more of a slender torso, but that actually looks, a, that's a bad, that's a, that's a terrible build. Everyone's different though. Everyone is different. That's probably going to be the best one, honestly. I don't know. It looks a little odd to me. Maybe this one's the best. Yeah, let's see this one again. Hold on. Yeah, that one looks fake as hell, so I don't want that. Oh, look at the legs. I was going to go with that, but the legs aren't toned enough. The legs, like, look at the, look at the, look, like, the legs look good there. It's like, look, leg focus. Legs are too bulgy, but you want the definition. These ones don't have the definition, which is kind of interesting. Like this one does. Like those legs are toned up. Look at those calves. So you didn't skip leg day at all. And this one is a little more tame. It's like the legs are no good. That one is just the funniest looking thing I've ever seen, bro. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, what about the large... I don't know if large makes sense for our weight. So it's like, yeah, because see, look at how broad his shoulders are. Like, that looks just hilarious. There's no way he's 220. 
Yeah, to me it just looks comical, so I'm not going to go with that. I, this this should be a pretty easy select. Let's just do that. Honestly, we got to commit. I love how the skin color just is there. Veins, except. All right. What about, wait, where's the hair at? Did I skip that part? Oh, it might be under body. It's weird. They mix they mix this stuff up, man. No. Maybe it's under attire. Okay, is this the ring attire? Appearance. There. Why? You think they would? Okay. Here's what's gonna happen. Yeah, I don't know why they would have that here, but I guess it makes sense if you want a wig. So let's find the appropriate hair for us. That ain't it. That ain't it, fam. We'll know it when we see it. Trust me. It's got. I know, like, I'm boring. That's like Super Saiyan, but he's kind of balding. <laughs> the little tuft. What's funny is the creation menus really haven't changed. They're, they're, they've like literally, literally been exactly the same for how many years now, guys? Seriously, all the way back to like the WWE, like, like even before WWE 2K was a thing. Like, when did 2K take over? 2K15, right? That was their first one. Even before that. Or was it 14? Even before that, it looked it was very similar. So the, they, they have... You can see where the budget is shifted. You know what I mean? Okay, I'm trying to find the hairstyle I normally like to rock. What the hell is that? I mean, the hair color is incorrect, so... It looks very shiny, doesn't it? I mean, that's something I... Wait, it's parting the wrong direction. Dude, I think this is it. This is our winner right here, guys. <laughs> what the hell was that? This is it, I think. There it is. That's the Daddy Dan Q hair. <laughs> I don't know about you, but my... I feel like my lips aren't really the same I mean it's close but anyway for, let's make them where's just your traditional colors why why did they make it why would they do that so now I have to so instead of picking like traditional colors I have to like now know what brown is Dude, that's so dumb. They don't have brown. <sighs> okay, well, I guess, I mean, you can kind of make it. Like, I don't want it to be green. I might have to go with a, an off color just because these idiots decided not. They just give you a slider. <laughs> well, that that's the idea. It is my old hair. <laughs> oh, that's lame. How's that? Now, sample colors are wrong, though. They're not... It'd be... I guess brown would be kind of in this kind of a spectrum, wouldn't it? It's still red. Man, do I ever hate that with a passion. Why would they do that, man? Then this hair dye. Oh, so you can do like streaks and stuff. So what I'm going to have to do... My material. Yes. Wait, black light? Oh, let's just accept this for a second. Um... Man, I hate that with a passion. Why would they do that? Like, they have previous colors, but, like, that's, like, his skin color. It, 
If, yeah, well, to be fair, it, it, yeah, the character creation does take up a good chunk of my time. I'm not going to lie. Because they have the grays, but they don't. And this is, like, kind of red. I mean, that's black. Like, but it looks red, you know what I mean? So it's like, is there a way we can make it look brown? But it always looks like it's a tone. You know what I'm saying? They used to have it. That's what I don't understand. Wow. I don't know. I'm, I'm choked as fuck, man. That's brutal. They don't even have, like, regular haircuts. It's like, well, you know what, man? It's 2023. If your hair isn't pink or purple or, or green or whatever, that's your, that's your options. Actually, that's looking a little more brown. Doesn't it? So 29... A little darker. That looks kind of brown, actually. Let's just rock that. I'll take that. At least, it, I mean, I don't know if it's exactly what it is, but it's pretty fucking close. I don't want to spend too much time trying to dye my hair. <laughs> All right, let's get the... Let's see, do they actually have my eye color? Probably not, but it's worth a check. I mean, they've got this, though. That's what's important. That's creepy as shit. Oh my god, they have a set of... Bro, they've got teeth. They've got teeth as an eye. That is so creepy. Oh my god. That's quite the contact lens, isn't it? What color would this be? That looks kind of grayish. They don't have mine here, unfortunately, but... I'm kind of like... In between these two here. If you, had, if you can combine this blue and this green, that's kind of what your boy is. It's a very tough eye color to recreate i love how this is under generic settable what are you talking about they're all the fucking same they haven't sorted anything honestly if i had to choose one i'll just do that and then i gotta do it for both eyes <laughs> All right, good. All right, facial hair, here we go. All right, settable. I don't know what that means. Unless it's like stacked ones, I don't know. Or remember, you could only have a certain amount of parts on your on your superstar at once, otherwise it would overload the, oh my God. Bruh. Oh my God. <laughs> oh, that's the one. <laughs> Oh, man. Oh, this is the mustache. <laughs> oh, man. That's good stuff. All right. Where's a decent beard? Like, one that I could actually work with, please. I mean, my beard can does grow to be that length if I leave it alone. But right now, it's not that long. So, I'm wondering if I should just... That's not bad. It's kind of like mine. I, I don't know. It might, I think mine's cleaner than that. They've added more, that's for sure. Remember they just they used to have a couple? They've given you the options. Oh my. That, that is aggressive. That right there is very aggressive. I don't know, man. I want something groomed, but also, like, it makes sense. Like, that's too low. That's too low as well. I actually think I chose a short beard for my superstar. Something like that. I don't think I went with a long beard. I think I actually went with something like that in the past. You know what I mean? Just kind of short crop, but it's because they didn't really have the, uh, the amounts. 4K, thank you so much for that super chat. Appreciate it. And then they go up to these ones, which are more, again, along the generic lines, I think. See, that one's too straggly. Look at that. Clean up your shit. It's, like, all clean, and then all of a sudden it's not. That one's pretty good. So I'll see this one. That one's a little more combed through. 
I don't like how ne how unclean the neckline is. Like, look at that under under there. It's like all it's all over the place. No, we're not doing just the chin strap. And these guys are too puby. Yeah, they, they don't look like he didn't look like he combed it. That's so funny. There's got to be one that's like a little more nice. I think that's why I went with the short crop. Like, that looks way too fake. That looks hilariously fake. Like, that's a little more realistic. But it's too short. I wish I could just advance on that. And your boy has the splits. Like, I don't have, like, a solid amount of hair here. Well, I do, but my hair goes... You know what I mean? Like, it's good for curling. Like, this one's just... Yeah, it's wrong. But obviously, this guy doesn't exactly look like me. I gotta make a choice, Dan. We're gonna be here all day. That looks terrible. Like, that's horrid. So is that, though. It just looks fake. Everything looks fake. Some of them look a little better than others, though. So I'm, I think I might end up... Like, look at that. Look at... look at. He didn't trim anything. Look at the sideburns. They're all over the fucking place. Like, no one... No one groomed? Like, come on, bro. I mean, that one's better. But it's, it's kind of weak. Like, look. It's like all beard down here, but he trimmed up here. It makes no sense to me. And that's too thin of a mustache. Ugh. I this is what stresses me out about the character customizations. Oh my god, it's Santa Claus! I just realized I'm so picky that it takes me thirty thousand years to actually create a character. So I do apologize in advance. <laughs> yeah, there isn't really one like my own though. That's the thing. There's like there's like a problem with each one. What was this one like? I mean, that one's okay, I suppose. Honestly, it's not bad. It's it's just it's not it's just it, the hair grows differently than mine. Like mine comes in cleaner. I don't I don't know. Maybe that one for now. Let's just hold on. we'll hold on to that one. We'll save that one for now. Let me just look at the. I don't honestly. I think that's like I said. I, well, I went with the short crop. I don't like that at all though. But they make them look so fake. Like see that one's that one's probably your best bet for short. This one here. So is it between these two then? Yeah, well, for now it is. Let's go back up to these bigger ones. Let me see this one again. I think this one was good except for the... No, it's too It's too all over the map. And then this one was, like, too fake looking. Actually, that one's not bad. The neckline, it's... That's actually okay. I don't like that they made, like, the one side, though. See that? Like, look. You turn it. Look at that. That one side is sticking out for no reason. Do you see what I'm saying? Like, like just why? Dude, it's a video game. Comb it. You can run a fake comb through it. And I don't get that curl out. Like, you see how at the end it kind of curls to the back? Mine doesn't do that. So, like, that's, like, maybe I should just go with this one. I can always change it. One thing I might do is copy that. Because that's brown right there, right? It defaulted to brown. So, let's just do this. And then I'll go back to my um, my hair and adjust the color to that one. That way it'll match the hair. Anyways, uh, let's go back up. Hair color. Good. Okay, what did I say it was? Let's take a look. So it's 43-31-21. So this one is a 12. 12. And then it's 43. So red is 43. The green is 31. Oh, wait, the blue is 29. Oh, wait. Wait, how do you even replicate that? Oh, hold on. Just go to the previous. Just go to these ones. There it is. Or is that not right? I like that better, actually. I don't know. Now that I look at it, it looks red. Well, probably because it is. We'll adjust, we'll what we'll do is we'll match the beard to the actual... Um, hair color I've used already. Oh, shit. Right, is this it? Or is this it? I think that's the one. Good. 
There's something about his lips, man, that I'm struggling with. I think the lips ain't working. Eyebrows are fine. Honestly, I don't want to fuck with these too much. Let's leave those alone. Exactly. It's a video game. You can design it however you want, so you think. Alright, normally... Now, I would like to do tattoos, but... They never do them correctly, so... Anyway. Oh, wait, what is this? Oh, this is just hair and shit? Oh, yeah. No, no. The wrestlers are shaved, man. They gotta be slick and sleek. Alright, let's get the clothing going. He doesn't usually need anything on his head, but we already know what he's getting. Alright, so this is ring attire. So his ring attire, let's, he's not gonna have anything on top, but he is gonna have... I don't like the trunks. I'm just trying to recall what I ended up doing. I did some sort of pant. Okay, go back. Uh, wrestling, I think it was just bottoms. And then we found ones that were kind of like, um, two-tone. Can you imagine wrestling in denim? I, I don't even want to know. You ever see those advertisements of, like, these types of jeans, and they're like, yeah, look how nice they are. And they're not, man. His bottom half looks like a, ch like, looks like a chick. It just ain't right. That ain't it. That ain't it, fam. I just gotta find the right pair of pants that isn't too wide. I think I actually ended up rolling with something like this. Yeah, actually, I think these are them. And then we'll just change the color. So the first color is gonna be as black as night. Black is night. And then the second color, which is the stripe, is going to be white. Whoops. It's because we can. That's kind of our, that's been our style since 1952. The belt is already black. I'll just fur fully black it out, though, just to be safe. And I'm assuming the other one is the belt buckle. I mean, what's it set to? No, we'll just leave it. We'll leave it as is. Make it look natural. There you go. Okay, now he needs shoes, correct? I mean, he ain't, he, we're going to give him some socks. There you go. <laughs> just go out there in socks and call it a day. Now, he, I did not give him sneaks. Short shoes. Yeah, let's go with the shoes. I want to give him some sneaks. But not those. I usually went with the Converse. I like the Converse look. Look, those look hilarious. They don't suit it. Get some highs. I don't remember if I did high tops or lows. Like, those look like... I don't even know what to tell you what they look like. Nah, see, it's it's I, it's gotta be, like, the Converse. Wear, wear sandals, yeah. How about these bright greens? Oh, God, man. It's, it's just too much of a solid color. It just looks heinous. How about that one? Oh, my God. Are these brogues? Pretty much. They're not brogues, but, you know. Okay, they don't... That, that looks like a bowling shoe. Dude, that's a bowling shoe for sure. These legit look like clown shoes. That, that is a clown shoe, bro. I'm sorry. That is what that's for. Short. Oh, I see settable. I get it. The ones... I know what settable means. It's like when you fill up all the parts. What, what parts can you actually set? The two-tone. How come they don't have like... <clears throat> how come they don't have like sneakers? Here you go. Here are the set. Here got some slides. <laughs> that's so dumb those some bitches imagine doing you know what would have been hilarious if they were realistic with it and homeboy did like a moonsault off the top rope and his flip flops just went flying <laughs> just right into the crowd well, that was his signature move he'd th take off his flip flops and yeet them into the crowd <laughs> oh, that'd be good shit man all these shoes are so ugly they're not what I thought. I was hoping for like 
an all kind of just like a low cut sneaker. You know, like they all these weird shapes. I mean, ten bucks says these probably look the best, but they're boots and they're too shiny. It's like, where did you shop? Like, where did you get these shoes from? Again, it doesn't have to matter on color. I can always change it. I gotta look for style. God, this I mean, this bit is so, always the tedious, most tedious, guys. I'm sorry. I I just can't honestly wear these shoes and be like, yeah, I'm cool with those. Like, have they never seen a shoe before? They look these look shit. How about this? See, they look okay in the picture, and then you see them, and they're like, what the fuck happened? It's like they don't know how to download, or... Uh, those are better, but they're not really what I'm after. I mean, I know I can always change. To be honest, those are kind of what I'm looking for. But they look so clown shoey. Like, look how huge they look. You know, maybe, you know what, let's try and, let's just mess with them a little bit. Let me just change the color, because maybe that's what's going on. So these will be black. Because that's what it is, those are Converse's, those are the closest things to it. And the bot, the soles will be white. Third color, so those are the inlets, I'm assuming, is it the inlets? Yeah, the inlet, it, oh no, those aren't inlets. We'll make them black, we'll make them a little more subtle. The fourth color, the laces, white. Honestly, now that we've changed the color, they look better. They do look better. We got those converses up. Yeah, see, it looks a little better now that we've modified them a little. It's still not, they still look a little big, but at this point, we do not care. Okay, and I'm accept that for now. I'm gonna base off it, okay? And I'm going to, it honestly looks pretty jobber, to be honest, doesn't it? Oh, God. Hold on. I got to go back through this. Bro, the shoes, they are. Look how big the shoes look. Like, nobody has shoes that look like that. Is there anything else I want to add? Well, let me just see. I hope I don't have to reset them. Like, that's what they are. But look how big they are. We need something more slender. I mean, those are better in terms of size. They look, I mean, they're, we can always adjust them. Like, in terms of size, like, these look like a clown. Like, Ronald McDonald wearing Converse. Look at the difference. Dude, look at the size difference. <laughs> oh, man. I think that's what we need a profile. How about these? Those look like decent... Honestly, man, those look pretty good. They're already my color, too. Those look more like... Yeah, you know what? I could probably mess with this. Let me just see the colors, though. These will be... Stark black. <laughs> they are their shoes. <laughs> Definitely. Uh, do I want the toe to be white as well? Yeah, why not? Fourth color. This is the lace, I believe. Wait, what is this? Oh, it's probably the bottom of the shoe? <laughs> Interesting. All right, well, those... You know what? I, those are a little more subtle. I think I can deal with those a little better. I think I prefer those. Now that I'm looking at them. All right, cool. What's up, Noah? How you doing? Hey, Wolf. What up, Delta? Sorry I missed a few of you guys. I've been deep in to the customization. Yeah. I wonder if it'll let me still modify, hold on, import. Wait, can I just copy, I thought you could copy this, set, copy attire, that's it. And then pop it here. Okay, and now we need, we need the vest, guys. We need the vest. Okay, so we have the base and the entrance. You guys already know what's going on. I hope you guys understand Wait, why did he take his pants off? Why are you taking his pants off? It's like, you know what? This I need to do this interview. I'm going to take his fucking pants off. 
Oh, is this body hair? Oh, whoops. Oh, I'm in the wrong. I'm in, I'm not in clothing. That's why. Sorry. I mean, I, that's why. That's why I took it off. All right. Uh, upper body. We need a top. I don't know if it counts as a jacket. It's got to be kind of jackety. What's I actually really like the sleeveless hoodie for a wrestler. That's actually pretty clean. I know it's it's Randy Orton's, but is this the like the the letter? It's almost a Letterman jacket. I don't know whose jacket that is. Forgive me, I haven't watched wrestling in a hot second. I got the Colonel Sanders ex, extra crispy. The extra crispy, and you just drop an elbow on him. You know what I mean? You drop that chicken leg. <laughs> it's a leg drop, and it's called the extra crispy. That's fantastic. All right, well, we got to find... I mean, this one's the German, German flag. Just in case you didn't believe him, you know. Where is... Is this the Letterman jacket? Yeah, pretty much. I need I need a vest. Guys, I need I mean I guess I could change it up. I can do it with the poncho. But you can't see I need the I need the sleeve I need the sleeveless vest. It doesn't have to be leather, but I'm sure that is a bonus. <laughs> oh no, it's Tyler Breeze's jacket. Too bad it wasn't blank. That would have been the shit. Man, that would have been perfect. I'm not seeing anything. It's all... I mean, this one's done up. If the... This is a... Look at the... What's he carrying in the hood? <laughs> Look at his hair. <laughs> Dude, he's got... You know what? It's like when, you know, when kids used to run away and they'd pack that little sack on a string. That's exactly what it looks like he's carrying in his hood there. And his hair is just... I don't know. It's, it's not working. It ain't working, guys. That looks a little better. I actually... I mean, you could rep that if you wanted. But we need the open vest. It's got to be the vest. And that's a roll-up hoodie. I'm, I, I have to come across it at some point. Oh, man. That's funny. It's always so funny watching these, like, some of these things, you know? It's like, there's always a glitch, the puffer jacket. I mean, I don't have to go with, like, what I, what's in my mind. I can end up finding something else. Oh, wait, no. Is this it? It's ripped. It's, it's a little too thrashy for me. I want something clean. Oh, my. They're already somebody, like, Cedric Alexander's right there. They already belong to people. Like, why would I come out with the RKO on there? I mean, that's a pretty badass logo, I gotta say. Looks cool. And this one's denim, correct? That's like almost rootin' tootin'. It's almost like cowboy-ish. This looks like the... Is this like... Okay, yeah, this is leather. That's a little too BDSM for my liking, fam. We're getting closer, though. We're in the right... We're in the right area. Something like that, but not like that. See, it's leather. The leather just looks hot. Degeneration X. Just come out with a DX jacket on. No, no, those ones you can't, actually. There's a part of me that does want to rep this just because of the tassels. It's like, it, honestly, the more ridiculous, the better. Sometimes, not always. This one's got a clasp. I don't like the clasp. That's not bad. It's. It, I mean, obviously, we can change the color of it. That's the thing. We can always change the color. Let's see how this vest looks. No. How's this one? Actually, I think that's the one we took. Now that I'm looking at it, it's what... Honestly, I think that might be our winner right there just because there's still a lot to go. It's short. Hold on. Let me just try and change the color and see if this is our winner. Hold on. First color. All black. It's it's almost snake skin. Croc skin. Buttercream croc skin. Buttercream 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 croc skin. Buttercream. What size is the waist? Let's go in. What about the material? First material. Dude, it's like a garbage bag. Can you imagine how bad vinyl would feel? What in the hell? Oh my god. 
Wait, black light? Oh, you can turn the black light on to like to see how it. Okay. All right, hold on. Uh, before we, okay, again, the color works. It's just I don't like the material. So let's just go down. I can always hit back, and then, oh, we get into the Austin, the Austin vests. You hear that glass shatter? Every time you get into an accident, he just looks like I don't know, sexy Aladdin at this point. These are there's not enough fabric where there needs to be fabric. <laughs> Like, you need that. This shirt doesn't fit you, bro. <laughs> what that is, I don't even know. Like, that looks too boxy, man. Like, get a fitted shirt, for God's sake. And then we're getting to the coats. You know what, man? I'm just going to stick with... What the fuck is that? <laughs> what was that? Okay, hold on. We're going to go and edit images. Yes, I know. Uh, lettering. You guys already know what's going on. got to be the bold font man that actually might be cool the spongebob letter <laughs> oh the spongebob lettering i kind of honestly i was gonna go with like this one but i wonder if this will look cooler i'm gonna go with this today well let's go around okay thank you okay let me move it please remember i couldn't figure out where the hell it was I'm worried it's going to be too, like, at this size, it's going to be a little bit, it's not, it's not going to be legible. I'm wondering if it won't work. It might, it might, hold on, it might, it might. Okay, hold on, we need another one. Remember, I was like, where is it? It's around the back. Yeah, it's Deluxe Edition. I, I wouldn't be able to play this if I didn't have it. You see what I mean? The font is a little aggressive, so it's kind of like... Uh... Like, see, it's centered here. I mean, it could look like it's connected. It actually might look cool. You see what I mean? It's like all one, like, signature. Let's see if that looks okay. Let's see if it looks okay. Might have to change the font, but... I learned my lesson. Oh. Come around the front, please. There you are. Yeah, dude. I hope he says it the same way. Bro, I can't. I hope he does. I don't know if I like it. Honestly, I'm, I'm having... The font is a little aggressive. It's not squared off. But maybe that's, I don't know, it just kind of looks like he's got a circle on his ass. Like, you know what I mean? It, like, doesn't. Yeah, no, I, I agree. I, I'm, I'm having the same trouble, Tiger. I am. I think, okay, let's try and edit that. Let's accept, but we'll just change the font. Images. Lettering. No, wait, hold on. How do you edit them again? Uh, They make it very difficult, don't they? Um, Yes. Okay, we'll just abandon. We'll just abandon. Sorry, guys. Had to abandon. Uh... <laughs> like, people might take me too seriously like that. Okay, so I can't tell. I I'll tell you what. Uh, I think I'll go with my gut on this one. I'm just trying to think what font would make sense. I Maybe this will make sense. Let's just move around the front. I was like, why is it doing that? <laughs> Yeah, no, that's not the right font. Uh, hold on. Can we just change it? Let's try this one. Why does it keep putting it around the back? It's dumb. I think this is it. I think this font will work. <laughs> oh, God. Unless it won't. <laughs> it 
It was all caps too, wasn't it? I don't know why you have to place it on the front to get the font. Oh, dude, it was this one, wasn't it? It was this font. See how it's more spread out? Watch. This one's more spread out and it's easier to read. Yeah, this is it. That's the one I used. Yeah, I fucked up. Okay, well, I don't know why you can't edit them. You have to, like... Like, if I go back, I have to go back. Like, it's dumb. It's like, I want to edit my current layers. But I have to say, no, don't proceed. You can understand, though. Man, people are going to be so pissed off because the people who don't watch this live, like, they tend to complain that, oh, you spent so much time creating a superstar. Just hurry the fuck up. It's like, well, you're not watching live. Just skip ahead in the video, bro. It's not hard. <laughs> if you haven't figured that out yet, you're kind of a dumbass. Anyway. <laughs> there you go. We'll rock that. Uh, wait, hold on. I got to position it better. Hold on. Yep. Okay, that'll work. Daddy. <laughs> I hope he says it the same way. Bro, I really, really do. It's He's got to say it the same way. If he doesn't, I'm going to be so disappointed. You might be right. I think I, you do have to do that. Pew. Daddy Dan. And the Q is the size of the moon. Ugh, see, the problem with the Y, the thing about a Y is that I'm technically in line with, like, the Y and the D, you see that? But because the Y is shifted over, it looks like it's not centered, but it is. That's uh, certain letters, you kind of have to compensate for that. Daddy. It's such a terrible jacket, man. You know what I mean? It's, oh, whoops. I'm not done. Get it. Bring it around. That might be on you, Cosmic. Try resetting your stream. Try, or just try, like, refreshing. Success. <laughs> That's how it was last time. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. What's on the front? You see that? Four parts. Oh, I see. Then you select the letters. What is that? Bro, there's something on the front of it. Was that always there? I just never noticed it. Hold on. Oh. oh. I see how they do it. Is it the letters from the... But why would it be on the front? That's not the letters. Is it really? That's really dumb if that's the case. Why would they mirror it? <laughs> Whatever. Okay, anyway. Sorry, this one I'm, I, I want to move this up a bit. Move. You, oh, I see what they're saying. Okay. Oh, it keeps grabbing the wrong one. God, why do they got to make this so fucking complicated? Yeah, that's better. I had to unaskew it like that. Okay, and this one, I think I'll just move it up just a tad.
There you go. You know, whatever. If that's how it is, that's some... Whatever, who cares? This, this game is already a train wreck. <laughs> All right, except... There's one thing we are missing. Oops, I missed it. Sorry, guys, hold on. One very, 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 very important addition. And I think some of you already know. I think it's a belt. My god. No! Did they... Did they remove it? I thought it was a belt. There it is! <laughs> it's back! And the color has to be the same, so we're just gonna do exactly the same thing I did last time. <laughs> it's gotta be the same. It's gotta be the same. Hold on, it's got to be the right font as well. Which font did I end up doing? I don't remember. Was it that one? That's the one. <laughs> That's the one. I know instantly. <laughs> one thing I actually, one thing I want to change about that. Hold on, let me just edit it. I think it needs to be lowercase. I think having all caps is actually kind of aggressive. And we'll just do some lower cases. <laughs> that's the one. Yep, that's it. That's exactly what it was. <laughs> oh, that is so good. I gotta figure out where it needs to sit. I remember I had the same issue. Let's just do that. There you go. <laughs> All right. It's back, guys. It's back. <coughs> oh, man. It's so funny. I love it. Daddy Danky was back with a vengeance, my dudes. Oh, let me go to the face again. Um... Facial parts, the lips are incorrect. How come there's no like, uh, f yeah, hold on. How come there's no like, li oh, what the fuck? Oh, come on. Is this just, just is this just like colors? Like default colors? Dude, did it just reset the whole thing? Okay, good. <sighs> Scared the piss out of me. I thought it like... close uh facial region i don't want to do that can't you choose from a set of like lips apparently you can't Maybe we should just accept it, leave it as is, and just hope for the best. Okay, let me just make sure the entrance. <laughs> Honestly, it's Jobber McJobberson, but it's all good. Personal info, name information, oh, that's all the same. You used to be able to test it. Like, you used to be able to, like, hear it. I really hope he says it the same way, man. It's, I really, really do. Hold on. Do you think it's gotta be? Dun, 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 dun,
dun 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 it's like, what are you doing? Your hips. Pop it. Lock it. Pop it. Put them up. 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 Put them up. Put them up. Pop it. Pop it. He kind of does like Dan Lazarian, doesn't he? I love it. Even the poses are cracking me up. Come on. Uh. Like, what are you doing? What's this? What is that all about? What are you doing with your life? Oh, man. I am sweating from laughing. <laughs> oh, grab it. Mm. Dude, there's so many. It's like you end up not caring after a while. Like, they're so similar. It's like, let's just put on. Yeah. Oh, that's the one. Yeah. There you go. Feel it. Look at the mug. Look at the mug on that man's. Do you guys understand why this is so important? Why this takes me so long? <laughs> slay, queen. Slay. Oh, man. Look at that. That is, that is a dub right there if i ever seen it. That is amazing, man. He's just... Getting that right out there. Oh, God. See, we've seen these already, but we're, like, not even halfway. What are you talking about? You can tell which ones are meant for females. That looks like he's taking a mean shit right now. It's like, check it. Who's engaged? <laughs> I can't, dude. This is just killing me right now. I need... That on... Uh, you just killed it, really. There's too many, bro. I'm not going to remember what I saw. Small dick. <laughs> mm -mm. I've had bigger. That's nothing. <laughs> really? Is that really? Is that it? Small dick. <laughs> Come on, give it to me. That's too small. <laughs> All right, I'm ready for it. Looking up at it. Wow, that's small. <laughs> <laughs> oh man we're having a good time the wrestling hasn't even started yet guys i'm just saying i'm just saying wow look at the leg extension we're finally oh the tush oh man don't rush me rush me ace don't rush me we're busy looking at poses. You don't understand that. Then we got two, three words. So I had to count them out. <laughs> two words for you. Two words for you, not three. I just do something simple. I'm going to end up doing something simple. Hmm. Maybe.
Uh, you know what? That's pretty fierce. Let's go with that. Fuck it. That's good enough. Set. Oh, set individually. No, that's good. So depending where you stand, hometown. All right, crowd signs. Get rid of that American one. No offense. Uh, this is awesome. Is fine. Uh, the guy behind me can't see. That's a classic. C4 energy. Yes. Nobody's going to bring this sign. This is my sign. Good enough. I'm a Heyman guy. Hi, Mom. My first ECW event, and it's not an ECW event. That'd be hilarious, man. WCW rules. Bald is beautiful. Uh, ha, ha. Hi, Mom. Sure, why not? Who cares? The side plates. I usually like just the generic ones because why would I put Finn Balor on my title? That looks like Spider-Man, doesn't it? I, I mean, I, you should be able to customize your own, but... Anyway, performance. All right, this one, you, you kind of have to skip ahead. The entrance. We're not even going to really see this. They give you a couple of generics. This one, I think this is the dire intention. This is what... Yeah, I like dire inten intentions. There's one where I'm, like, way more celebratory. You look mad about it. Yeah, I'm bunching on. Yeah, it's like, yeah, right. That's right, bro. It's so generic, bro. Screw it. Choose taunt. Fired up. See, I can't. They, they do it on purpose. I think I ended up going with warming up. It's because it's like a bit of a dance, you know? The signature, I don't have a choice about this. No. The big boot. Wicked stepsister. German suplex. Ripcord lariat. Alvar, thank you for being a member of the last three months. Appreciate you. Now, I think I might honestly do like the running hurricane run. It makes sense. And then the finisher, I honestly might just go with the spear because I that would be awesome. I'm going to do the spear. Cool. Stats. Oh, the paybacks. Right. Okay, so I think you can unlock these as you go through as well. Uh, no. Resiliency is good. I usually do that. Um, hold on. Power of the punch. Brass knuckles. Move thief. Blackout. Teleport. Come back. I think I'm going to go with resiliency. Oh, it's already there. And, oh, come back. Those two are both the ones I would choose anyway. The other ones are too risky. Okay, it's about to go down, guys. We are over an hour in, and let's do it, finally. Finally. Daddy Danky was ready. That took me over an hour to do it. So, yeah. You're welcome. <laughs> I am so close to having this title renamed in my honor. Can you imagine? The Sammy Continental Championship <laughs> has a nice ring to it, if you ask me. All I have to do is defend it tonight, and WWE will have no choice but to give in to popular demand and make the change. I have no idea who I'm facing, but it doesn't matter. I am going to beat whoever it is, and you will never, ever see the Intercontinental Championship again. Wait a second. Is this finally happening? We've been seeing and hearing about this person for weeks. Could this be the long-awaited debut of The Lock? I'm not sure what or who else it could be. The Lock has arrived! 
dude, I didn't even, I changed my attire. Where's the Daddy Danku attire? Dude, he looks like a gimp. Championship could be changing quickly. We've heard the lock is a future champion, and we might not have to wait long for that to come true. What the hell? Oh man, Sarah, thanks for the extra gifted. Let's go. Oh, that's 450. Let's go. Veteran competitor in Sami Zayn. Sammy might have the experience edge, but he was caught off guard here tonight. So I'd actually give the advantage to the lock. You might have a point, Saxton. Sami Zayn looks like he's hesitant to even go through with this match. He's shook. I don't blame him. Can the lock live up to all the hype? We're about to find out. So I'm assuming something's going to happen to me. All right, let's see if I remember all the controls here. Hold up, let's move me over a little. I remember I had to do this last time. This is kind of the sweet spot. Long away to debut is happening right now on Monday Night Raw. And what a way to kick things off as Sami Zayn's oh. challenger. I have it set to hard, by the way. Championship. There's been a lot of talk about Oh, God, don't you mess me up. How the lock's going to change. Where's the key? Come on, Sams. Bye. We. <laughs> that is the attitude of a daredevil. The ability to take risk with minimal trepidation. Guys, we're already we're already ready to go. Absolute reckless abandon. Back elbow. See? Did you see that? The champ trying to roll with these. Oh, I missed it. No need to panic. He's still swinging. There, this is your tutorial, basically. Whip back into the ring. I'm fine. He's See. got him scouted. Look at Did I miss it? Yeah, they're trying to get you to sign up for a reversal. Right to the spine. Man, my timing is not working. Oh, it's because I'm out of reversals. I just realized that. I'm out of reversals. I'm in trouble. Wasting no time getting his shoulder up. I suppose you have to take the shot, but it's still too early to wrap up this one just yet. Oh, I missed. As if Sammy couldn't be any more annoying. I got comeback. Oh, I messed it up. Damn. You're such a noob, bro. They've changed some things, so it's not all the same. So that's something I got to try and remember. See, they're not letting me reverse. I'm not getting into my shit back, so I've been... Nothing I can do about it. It's funny, whenever I am told to do something, that's when I... Prime example of working smarter. Usually the higher high, the high There you go, finally. Oh man, big time. From a heavy grapple. From the corner position. The champ. And this match is not over yet. Things are only going to get harder from here. And some effective offense with that one. Oh man. I can't wait. How, how do I do a heavy grapple again? And lock gets surprised there. Oh, I tried to reverse. Oh, I'm bleeding. I'm bleeding. Devastation. Hold on, let me just double check. Uh, yeah, yeah. Press Irish whip him. Then press. Oh, that's what I thought I did. I did press X. Maybe it's because I put it in a direction. Just want a generic heavy grapple. Oh, I missed it. The ref was in the way. Too early. Oh, he got me, bro. He's kicking my ass out here on Raw. Don't worry. Once we get warmed up, we'll be laughing. Toss back into the ring. 
Get up, me. The lock and key. This could be big. Going up high. Blast off. Dude, I ran away from that. Oh, I think it countered his... I think I was... I don't really know what to say about it. Man, my room. I'm getting my ass whooped on street hoops. My God. I gotta get my reversals down. He got whipped into that corner. Oh my god, my timing, bro. Oh, that's it. It's over. Dude, this is his oh my god moment. Oh, this is through this is the DDT. <laughs> that's it. I think I'm done. I think I might have to restart. That would put me out. I've got ring rust. Okay, let's just do what we need. Oh, come on. There's your comeback. I'm just trying to get him in the corner, but he's falling off. Just regular X. What the hell is going on? You don't say, Saxton. I'm doing that. Sami Zayn needs to dig down deep as he's done Guys, it's not so working. Many times in the past. Into the corner now. I'm literally just tapping X. It's something. It's it's. Wait, didn't it tell me to do? Oh, I gotta grab him first. Oh, my fault. Sorry, 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 sorry. Yeah, my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad, my bad. Circle first. There it is. Okay. Headlock applied. Here we go. Across the ring. Big kick. Okay, what's the opponent on again? Oh yeah. Kind of give me a bit of everything. It's almost like showcase. Signature move. Wait a minute. It looks like they set my signature move for me too. Okay, what is wait oh, let's look then if they change all my shit up um oh it's still the spear oh that was the top row one the avalanche bulldog so it still is that okay i see so here let's get him up he has a right where he wants him oh wrong button there it is Sorry guys, the rust is cr oh he's out. And I just gotta win. I'm end up changing that move. The more move most of the time I let them do whatever the moves there are. Oh I hope we do. It looks like we're gonna win the championship. Sammy Zayn retaliates. A stalemate of counters. Get in the ring. And he throws the opposition back into the ring. Desperate attempt here to get back on his feet. Oh, he got out of that somehow. Yeah, a tough night so far for Sammy. Wow, quickly moves. Uh oh. Got out of it. 
punch to the stomach and stopped in their tracks. Okay, we're gonna go for it. I don't know if it's enough, but he's pretty hurt. Superstars can say they captured championship gold their first night on the job. We heard so much about this superstar, how he was the next big thing, a future Come world on. champion, and so far I have every reason to believe those are true statements. I'm just glad we won't have to see the Sammy Continental Championship. Me too, Byron. I think we all owe the lock a thank you for that. Hold up, Sami Zayn from behind. Well, apparently this isn't over. The lock ducks and he nails him. Sami goes head first into the side of the safe. Wait, what's he doing? Oh, I'm going to lock him away. Lock up Sami. Yes, do it. Into the safe. We might never have to see Sami again. Thank you. Now what? He's going to send Sami for a ride. Dude, that's, 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 that takes some strength. Once again, your new Intercontinental Champion, The Lock. What a The debut. Lock says, The Lock, The Lock. <laughs> <laughs> know your role and don't forget your password. <laughs> do, you do you hear when The Lock is ticking? <laughs> All right, I'm sorry. The lock says, the lock, the lock. There he is. Ready for your big Raw debut tonight? Yeah, can't wait to get out there. Good, we can't wait either. This has been a long time coming. And you've earned it. Thanks. Hey, what's up with the camera? She's been following me around since I got here. Oh, talent relations didn't tell you? It's for this documentary thing they're shooting on you. Sorry, I'm terrible with names. It's Kat, right? Yep, Kat with a K, K-A-T. Sorry I didn't introduce myself earlier, but when I'm shooting these, I gotta be a fly on the wall. No one asked. You're going to be seeing a lot of Kat over the next year. Got to document the rise of the next big thing. The future world champion, The Lock. Whoop, whoop. Sorry, fly on a wall. I've been meaning to talk to you about that whole The Lock thing, by the way. I, can I just use the name I've used my entire career? I Daddy mean, Dan Q. That's how the rest of the world knows me. Yeah, but that's not how the WWE Universe knows you. We can't assume they've seen any of your matches before this. I think a lot of people have. Isn't that how WWE found me? Look, this is typical for superstars who come up outside the system. WWE likes to put their spin on things, and 99% of the time, it's a huge improvement. Okay, but doesn't the name sound too much like The Rock? It sort of does. Do you mind? <laughs> Think of this as a new and improved version of yourself. We have a proven track record with this sort of thing. You just need to trust the process. Is that what you're required to say now that you're office? No. Corporate requires me to say and do a lot of things, but that's not one of them. I don't know. It feels restrictive. I just want to be myself. I hear you. But it's not just a nickname. The entire WWE machine is behind this. We have a huge entrance planned with Pyro, a championship opportunity, new gear. <laughs> They're shooting this whole documentary about you. And we got this for you too. Get it? A lock? <laughs> is that left over from John Cena's chain gang days? Maybe. Things worked out okay for him, didn't they? Guess so. I gotta run. But I promise, this is gonna be fine. 
Just trust the process, and it'll all work out. Because remember, you're the luck. We good here, or...? Yep, got what I needed. That's a cut. Man, the lips don't suit my character at all. How come I... I wish I... I should have made them smaller. Proud of him, the lock. Knew he had it in him. The lock says... The lock. The lock. Oh, wait. We're still... Leaf two on Ra. Let's see what they have in store for me. Can't be any crazier than last week, right? Hey! I didn't get the chance to say hi last week. That was a hell of a debut. Thanks, Gabriel. Yeah. <laughs> Call me Gabe. Excuse me, Gabe, can you turn to camera and introduce yourself? Seriously? I've been in WWE for 10 years. I think whoever's watching will know who I am. We probably won't use this, but just in case. Fine. I'm Gabriel Slade. Three-time U.S. champion, two-time intercontinental champ, multi-time tag champion, and all-around good guy. Does that work? Thanks. Anyway, just wanted to welcome you to WWE. I know it can be hard sometimes for people to get acclimated here. It's going okay so far, but yeah, it's a bit of an adjustment since I didn't come up through the Performance Center. Or even work the U.S. scene much before this. Okay. Well, let me give you some quick tips to fit in. Make sure you fist bump and or shake everyone's hand every time you see them. Be willing to give up your first class seat if there are veterans and coach. And uh, never sneeze around the big boss. Never. Well, I don't want to overwhelm you, but if you ever need any help or advice, I got your back. <laughs> I think I'm good, but thanks. All right. Later, Locke. Call me champ. Okay, champ. That was a good dry run. Now, let's do another take without the interruption from the Raw Welcoming Committee. <laughs> Jeez, no wonder that guy has never really made it. I'm too friendly. Damn. I think we got it. I need to go get changed. All right. Well, I don't know. I don't know when I should come back. It's like, should, like I don't want to block the cutscenes. Just give me a second. Okay. Man, is this still loading? For real? Holy shit. Alright, there you go. He's a lock. Alright, that's our first halfway mark. My right up. This is the hub. You can discover new story opportunities from here by talking to people within this hub or by replaying the po to posts and direct messages. Replying, sorry. So do we have the list of... I only need to focus on must plays. Okay, well, I'm... Let's go to the info again. On, let's let's I want to see that I might have skipped it uh, yeah, I can say whether you're taking them must play story so that's the WWE optional exclamation or challenge match so we want to do everything in this game yeah okay so that's a must play Corey Klein it's got something for me oh Fanny wait she, oh, she was from the previous game all right well, we have, oh before we do anything at all let's go to the options menu I want to see the story progress Oh, I like that. Okay, so there's 13 of these. So there's a lot of optional ones. So making headlines is our first chapter then. All right, let's just change. I wasn't sure how they were doing it this year. So, yeah. Sorry, guys. I'm just changing the title because I wasn't sure what it was called. I think they made it uh, a little bit more... Uh, like organized this time so there's 13 of these and it looks like there's only like know your role i'm guessing the rock is going to make a day appearance here he must be making an appearance les mis these are all optional all in this making headlines chapter i think 
All right, so because I have Deluxe Edition, I got the Early Access, all this stuff, um, essentially, I get to, um, I get a bit of an advancement right off the bat. So I get like 200 points to spend on my character. So we're going to go ahead and do that. It comes with the Deluxe Edition. Uh, I think submission I want down. I want my striking. Let's bring as many things as we can up. Uh, defense. I'm not going to do a submission, so it's like... Oh, I only have 14 left, so... I'd rather put it into that. Maybe a little into defense, just to, or into this. Just so I have some sort of defense here, but my aerial running is up, so we're an 85 overall. Okay. Good. Socials. Socials provide another way to engage in stories. Social media posts appear in your social media feed. Indirect messages appear in DM inbox. You also filter your SM and DM feeds by which posts lead directly to stories. Some social media and DMs are just comments on your Superstore and stories, but won't directly lead to a new story. Just like with Superstars within the hub, you'll notice the, the same must-play optional and story gate icons next to various social media posts. So they made it easier to understand how to link up uh, directions. That was something that was kind of lacking. It was like people missed certain storylines because they didn't know how to link them together. So it's actually showing you. So to start a story gate, it's going to have the two lines next to it. I like that. Important to look around the hub and view your social media feed to every story that needs to be played. I see. So if I go to my social feed... So I want an example of that then. Oh, Helms. I got my hurry up hours, bitch. So do you everything will work out if you trusted the process? Definitely happy with the result, but still not completely solid on all the lock stuff. What if I... Uh, what if I at least get to do my own entrance now? And that's fine. There's some legal stuff going down about the safe entrance anyway. I'm sure you'll hear more about it soon. Cool. I also decided to stick with DanQ8000 instead of the lock. Not sure if you or anyone in the office. Yeah, we noticed. Are you salty about that, Shano? Intercontinental champ. Not sure about all that lock bollocks, but I can't argue with the results. Thanks, Davish. I don't know about it either, but maybe it's just temporary. Friday, it wasn't that long ago. You were sleeping on my couch in between working shows here for 10 quid. You've come a long way. They really want us to know that he is um, British <laughs> for 10 quid. All over the world. Can't believe he's in WWE. After that Incontinental title win over Sammy, might have to change my handle. Lock for life. That's cringe. Lock secured Intercontinental champ. Thank you. Bailey, no one in WWE is safe from the lock. Sorry, couldn't resist. Thanks, Bailey. Appreciate that. I thought Stealing Legends gimmicks was my thing. The lock. Oh, got him. So I went digging through the WWE archives and found my old chain. That's funny. So you did mention part of the lock. I knew it had an in him. I'm supposed to be partial, but the lock is the real deal. So everyone's saying nice things. But I didn't go to WWE and have to come out of a safe like the lock. I think I'll continue to dominate social media and wrestling everywhere else in the world instead. Okay, whatever you say there. My WWE TV debut, I lost my name, gimmick, entrance, song, finisher, all my and my WCW Cruiserweight Championship all in one night. If I survive that, Dan will be just fine. All right. Well, anyway, that's your socials. I'm going to play with my move set a little bit more before. And if there's any moves I don't particularly like, I will. Uh, I will do it then. Let's talk to him. Hey, champ. Long time no see. You here to cash in on some more tips from a certified locker room vet? How do I get a match? Yeah, I was wondering, how do I get a match? Great question. From my experience, matches get booked in one of two ways. Talking to people, or checking your social media messages. Talking what do you to mean, people. talking to people? Exactly what it sounds like. Aside from being booked by management, talking with superstars, the crew, or other backstage visitors can lead to opportunities. Sometimes people might have favors to ask of you. Others might have bones to pick. He's just giving me a tutorial. You know how they this. say it's who you know. That's definitely. I'm true in a bad spot, aren't I? Who you know 
and who you talk to. <laughs> Where's that? <laughs> Just a little bit. <laughs> That's terrible. It's not safe. I'm gonna get demonetized. <clears throat> Seems easy enough. All right. Don't try to put too much on your plate, though. If somebody wants a favor, you can always tell them no and come back to it later. Or even defuse a tense situation. But once you agree to something, you'll need to see it through. Copy that. So it's saying so once you lock into a story a or a match Makes a challenge, sense. you have to finish and it. And the other way to get matches? You mentioned social media. I assume I shouldn't go dark on there while I'm a WWE superstar? Definitely not. Even a veteran like me is always seeing what kind of trouble I can brew up on social media. The master log. If you don't check your SMs I think the masterpiece might have a problem with that. miss out on opportunities. Not everything there will lead to a match, but it's worth keeping up with what the WWE universe is up to. Okay, so check my social media feed and direct messages. Got it. Yeah, I'm right. flyer. Any other questions or anything you'd like me to explain again? How do I improve my in-ring skills around here? It's like the old saying goes, practice makes perfect. The more matches and experience you have in WWE, the better. You guys want some cheese? From there, it's usually up to you to determine how you want to apply what you've learned. Whether it's improving your strength, getting better at submissions, or putting more power behind your punches. You get the idea. You said it's usually up to me what I want to improve. Yep. Sometimes certain kinds of matches will benefit you in a more specific sort of way. But if that's the case, you'll know that going in. Sports entertainer insight, I call it. Okay, cool. All right. Any other questions or anything you'd like me to explain again? How do I get one of those tour buses that some superstars travel in? <laughs> uh, win a lot of matches and make a lot of money. But in the meantime, if you need a good rental rate on a mid-sized sedan, I got connections. They actually do have to drive to their own events. It's kind of messed up. I'll keep that in mind. The big guys go on the buses, but... All right. Any other questions or anything you'd like me to... I think I'm good. Actually, I think I'm good for now. All right. Well, like I said... If you ever need advice, or even if you just forgot your flip-flops for the shower, I'm here for you. Got it. Thanks, big player. Can you imagine, though, if I was, if I kept my flip-flops, you know, where I needed to keep them? All right, anyway, so Gabe is just kind of giving you some fan. The fan. Let's talk to her first. She's got a challenge. Want to join my book club? I tried to recruit Robert Rude, but he said the only part of a book he likes is the ending. Or, as he called it, the book's finishing move. He said he's got the best ending in WWE, but I thought maybe you could take him on and show him yours? Sure! It's just a quick match. That's all it is. It's just like a little baby bitch match. You know, you just go and you just go, Let's go. I'm going to fuck you up. You know what I mean? The luck. The key. What you going to do to me? Got the luck. The key. The man destined to be top dog. It. Oh, wait. I, did I skip mine? Oh, I skipped mine, guys. Oh, wait. But I'm not going to have my fanny pack. Oh, wait. Okay. Well, next match we have, I want to see if they go with Daddy Dan Q. It's a shame to play with those balls. What? That was rude. Anyone else ever heard Rude say he's got the best? Okay. I don't know if that was it. Maybe my foot caught it. I thought I got the reversal. I remember Here Comes the Pain being really fun. It was so over the top. Okay, there's no reversals, and he's spamming this move. That's rude. Bobby. Dude, he's... <laughs> Why am I here? Why am I even here? Guys! He's just... <laughs> 
this match than we previously thought. And an I got no reverse. <laughs> <laughs> He's not camera. No, there's no reversals. I got no reversals, man. Find Rude showing any <laughs> He's just spamming the same move. That was a showing of control and aggression. Something they'll want to keep. What up. am I supposed to do? <laughs> oh my God. Bro, I literally spamming. It's not square, bro. It's triangle, and I don't have any right now. My, I like if you look in the bottom, like look right here. I don't have any. I don't have people give me advice, and they don't know what's going on. He's executing on his plan perfectly. Keep on the attack. Certain attacks I'm able to reverse finally. Get the hell down. He's just spamming moves. Oh, wake up, Taunt. Trap the arm. Neckbreaker. So smooth. He's absorbing. Man, he's reversing tough. everything. It's annoying. Yeah, Cole, but at this point in the match, you still haven't lost the edge. Just a ruthless streak for the world to see. Heads out of the ring. What's next? Bro. Oh boy, come on. Not Bro, I, wait a minute. Chair. He's gonna get he's disqualified. It won't let me reverse there, finally. So apparently we can use these. <laughs> so they changed that then. I don't like that comeback. That's weak. That's got to be changed. And Rude reverses. Rude might be waking up now. Rude was being tested, but finally was able to get some offense of his own. Throw him. There they go. Santon. That was coming in hot at breakneck speed. Going fast and living dangerously. I gotta show him that. Toss back into the map. What the hell happened? What was it the delay? through the arena. Oh, he knew what was coming. Oh, they changed it again. Hurricane Rana. Get out of the way, ref. Looks like he has his finger on the trigger now. Oh, they keep changing. Sorry, the buttons are different. I'm not used to what they are. I thought it was triangle before, but maybe it's not. Maybe it's always been X and I just forgot that. Oh, I'm debuffed. That's why I wasn't able to reverse. I almost nailed my finisher. I would have nailed it, but again. There it is. Boo! He doesn't say it the same way anymore. I mean, to be fair, we'll forever have that special place in our heart. Cute. Like, it's all, like, normal until he says daddy. Dad. This one, he, 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 it, it's not as fun. It's not as fun that he said it that way. That's okay though. That was that was ridiculous. Guys, can you tell I'm ring rusty? I still got it. So that should be it. For, oh, Adam Pierce has another one. Adam, you're a Pierce of shit. Welcome to Raw. Thanks. Got to say, I've been a fan of your work for a while. How you doing? Can't say the same for Drew cool. Gulag though. I heard him mention your name in a rant about superstars who lack fundamentals. Fundamentals, according to who? Drew. 
But if you ever want to put in a little extra super specific training before a show, you know who to ask. Out fundamental Drew in the ring. I mean, it's about... Is it, if this is a submission one, I'm going to be in trouble. It's a shame to say that you suck ass. That's quiet in here. Oh, whoops. Ow. Grrr. Ah. <clears throat> I forgot the guys like Ah, they sound like it sounds like a porno when you're and there's no one in the in, in the crowd. Why? <laughs> Did I miss him? Ooh. Okay, hold on. How do you dodge him? Show you. Okay. Dodge one. Press. Oh. Ah! <laughs> Right? It's R1, right? Oh, see, so you just gotta wait until he attacks, and then you... I see. Get up! I did dodge it. Technically, I did. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. You got out of it. See some moves you can't reverse. What are you gonna try and where's he putting me? Really? That was on me. I think this is a signature move. Yeah, this like Oh, I crunched him good, bro. Are right, he stunned? Let's try getting the pin. I like the damage on your body, though. That's kind of neat. No, nah, I need to. I need to do a finisher. I love the like. Mm. Oh, he reversed that. They gave him a chance to get up. See, no reversal option. That backfired. See, it's not... Yeah, it's like, how do I know I can reverse? If I need some sort of button. Not just that one. 
Is he going for the pin? Got it. High flying action! Kobe! Oh, he got out of it. Come on, let's. Okay, we have the finisher. Let's get him. Priest mode. That should do it. Oh, I get it now. So the yellow ones are your, your signatures, and then you get a finisher when it says F. Or is... Right? All right, we'll do it again. Dude, this guy, there's no way. He's done. That's too back to... I'm sorry. It says attempt to win the match. I'm wondering if I can't win it. Moonsault. Whee! Dude, there's no way. One, two. Is he is he scripted to win this? Ah, uh, reversal. That's <laughs> so dumb. This looks silly. Not really try point. Oh, to attempt to pin. No, see, it doesn't matter. Yeah, so I can win either way. Maybe I'll just try a regular pin. One, two, there we go. He was just kicking out like a beast. Under a lock and key. Okay, we're not going to progress. Is there another one? There must be a lot of them if they're just going to keep going back this way. I just interviewed Ludwig Kaiser, who said WWE matches aren't enough of a test. So he's now proposing a five out of nine falls match. Management hates the idea and would love it if someone could take him out in a two out of three falls match to shut him up. Interested? Two out of three falls, sure. Sometimes it's program weird, Steve, I've noticed. Shit. It's the future of WWE, The Lock. And his tag team partner, The Key. I should turn off entrances. I keep forgetting about it, but I won't have my fanny. champion is taking on the German sensation Ludwig Kaiser in a two out of three balls battle of endurance tonight. I think that's endurance. I heard this was originally supposed to be a five. I want a different running finisher or, you know, or running move. Good time to make sure we have overtime written into our contracts. I can't remember how to do the. Um... Going up top. From the heavens. Oh. Just crashing down with high impact. Ducking out of trouble. You've solidified your name as a top athlete when you're able to pull You do that, and then I can't remember how to do it. I gotta figure it out. Locke launching attacks left and right. Yeah, Locke is proving hard to keep up with. And he goes into the ring. Yeah, I remember those, Dave. I might change the calf kick. Lydia was ready for that. Close line. Well, that'll be the mark. 
Oh. Oh, hold on. Wait, oh, wait, is it? Wrong button. Oh. Oh, I got the ref. Sorry. I don't know why this is a comeback. I'm winning. I'm kicking his ass. I don't know how the superstar is doing it. Down and out moments ago. Back in it now. For the victory here. Oh gosh. And a kick out right away. He tried to get me with that cheeky pin. Might be enough. It's best two of three. First ball. Oh, that's embarrassing. Whoops. I was nowhere near it. My bad. Got him without even going to the second one. And he's out and delivers a knee. And Zagiri finds his mark. Oh, and an impressive amount of offense against him here. Yeah, and this has to decrease his composure moving forward. Got oh, kicked in the side of the face. Running Swanton finds the mark. He's looking completely lost as he finds his footing. Beautiful. He's, He's toast. I might as well go for him. I have another one in case I need it. I think he's toast. They didn't say the lock though, which is you think they change it temporarily until maybe you get your own persona back. Under a lock and key. Look inside of this big man. All right, nine lives. I see what they did there. That's cute. I mean, I might as well go through all the... Oh, that's it. Corey Klein. See, they're going to let you do all the challenge matches up to this point. Happy Corbin has been mouthing off about his football career more than usual lately. Saying the WWE grind is the same as non-stop two-a-days, which is why he's so well-equipped. <laughs> Give me a break. Take him on after a workout, showing you can compete after a two-a-day of your own. Let me guess. I'm going to be down on uh, stats. Wait, do they still have those? Is it just attributes this one, or do they have those abilities? Do you remember? I can't recall, but I went with a high flyer, Andrew. So I'm gonna be down. Yeah, see, I'm down after a workout. Corbin's pretty tall. Ow! I'm waiting for. Oh, I was waiting for that, and I timed it wrong. Ah! Ugh. Ow! Ugh. 
What's up, Jay? You're going for the pin? Oh no! Dude! What the hell happened there? They they changed the damn game up. The mini game. So I lost. Can I can I retry it? Oh. I see. So if you lose, you get less. Well, that was kind of lame. Oh well. How much do I have? Oh, I only have 14. No, I want to save up. You should be able to redo it. That's kind of cheese. I got annihilated. I just couldn't... I mean, at least they give you something for it. It's just like... It's just optional. Don't forget the cardio next time you hit the gym. So she's making... Well, she's not making fun of me, but... Ludwig, on the other hand, they're just these. These don't li go into anything, though. I mean, they count. Right, those are all the challenges. Okay, social feed, stories, no stories. Same thing with DMs. You can go with sorted by stories. There are none. All right, so we'll actually go into our next. Um... Oh wait, hold on. Before we do anything, let's go back to. Uh. You know, what up, mouse? Thanks for being a member of the last month. I'm doing good. Hope you're good. I'm going to just quickly adjust a couple of my running moves. Like I said, as I think of them, I would like to adjust them. You know what I'm saying? So we're going to go with uh, running. Where is it? Uh, there's a lot. I don't like going through all of them. Springboard holds standing. Where would they put it? Ground. Standing front. There you go. Front running. Calf kick. Um, close line from hell is, hell is fun. Like, I don't really care for that. Corkscrew calf kick. I want it to be pretty quick. Like, like imagine running and then dropping to your knee to do that. I, I think I usually did a, like, clothesline from hell just because it was fast and it was murderous. Uh, let's sort by... You punch... Jump clothesline is pretty sweet, too. I might actually do something like that. You know what I mean? That's pretty lit. I might go with something like that. The brogue kick. I remember back in the older WWE games, I would just literally, like... Um... I would just like do all finishers for regular moves. So like, and, and everyone, would, you know, everyone wouldn't freak out. And then you did a finisher and it's like, oh my God, but you're doing these crazy finishers as your basic moves. And, and oh man, I kind of like the running elbow, etc. Flying forearm might work too. Pin combo options, none lifts. Those are dumb. And then it's just targets. Um, what did I say? I think I want to do that. We'll see if we enjoy it. And then there's a heavy attack. This one I might do. It's the same. It's got the same shit, right? Yeah. Maybe that, just because it's a heavy. And it's got a pin combo. Combo. It's like a little back, like an actual backflip. The Thez press. You gotta, you gotta love those. But honestly, I like ones that are faster. So like, you know, you do them and you move on. You know, that's always been my jam. Um, 
I like the flying forearm smash. I might replace. I might honestly, if it's slam, I might do the fall away moonsault. This one I've never been a huge fan of because you get three of them. 316 Thez Press. <laughs> Tilt the world EDT, maybe. No, it's too much. I mean, it's cool, but it's. It takes too long. I mean, that's fun. The stun dog millionaire. Oh, that's a double. Maybe just the sling blade? That's a sick move. I, you know what? Let's roll with that. I, I, okay, here's the thing. I'm not sure if I want the jumping. This is going to be probably one of my most common moves. This one here. So it's either going to be the jumping clothesline. Unless. See how fast it is? Um, where did I sit? What was the other one I was thinking of? I mean, the flying elbow is kind of sick. But the flying forearm smash is pretty fast. You know, it's almost like, let's go. Crazy, thanks for the super chat. Thank you, bro. I appreciate it. I think I might go with the forearm because it's a, just a, it's it, it you know you get up faster, so that's something I wanted to adjust. Everything else we'll leave it until I uh, oh rear running. Let's see rear running. These are lame, but there's less of them in this. This is all we got. No, running no. Running super kick. Rear clothesline. I'll do that. And you're heavy. That could set him up for that. Honestly, I'll leave the drop kick and then tilt the world arm drag. I don't I don't like how long. It's like, bro, why don't you just take him out to dinner? That's sick. Right, I'm cool with those. Okay. Honestly, I'll leave this for now until we try with it. Oh, rebound action. Rebound attack. Is this rebound? Yeah, it's rebound light attack. So shouldn't it be a quick attack? Oh, we'll leave it for now. Like I said, I don't want to get too far into this. My springboard is already pretty slick. I think I'm... Nope, I hate that with a passion. I'm glad I changed... I, I'm glad I'm changing this. This is not happening. Maybe something like that. No, I don't like that. You gotta go with it. If it was like a... I've, I think I've already got a couple of moonsaults so it's like this is to a standing op opponent by the way maybe a springboard roundhouse that could be sweet springboard stunner bro oh! Oh! oh the top rope moonsaults are slick as hell you get huge air but i think i've already got the let's see do i already have the top rope oh my god i hate that with a passion What's the body cutter again? That's dirty. Running, springboard, crossbody. Those are fun. No, I don't want this. I want. I think I might go with a big clothesline on this one. From outside. It's gotta be murder, like you're diving. What was the X factor? Oh yeah. Mm -mm. We've gotta launch over the edge, guys. No, no slingshots. The phenomenal. That is sick. That's AJ's, I believe. Vaulting body press. 
Springboard Santon. Nah. That's pretty lit. Let's see what the DDT looks like. That's pretty sweet too. Honestly, you can't go wrong with a crossbody. That one's like a five star pre or splash almost. Frog splash. Let's do that. All right, and then what else? Tornado DDT. That's always fun. I'm actually okay with that. This, the bulldog's got to change. That's grabbing it. Wait, do I have any? That's running. Honestly, the ones that bounce are pretty sweet too. But that's just standing, that's not running. Why not? All right. I'm gonna end up doing this a lot. I'm okay with that. Phoenix splashes are pretty intense, aren't they? Yeah, let's go with that. Fuck it. The 630 Centon is just, <laughs> it's just spinning for days. <laughs> it's off the chain. <laughs> Oh, it's going to be fun, man. All right, to ringside. No Hurricane Ranas, but there's less of them here. Shooting star, because it, it's like usually a backflip. No, no. Corkscrew Moonsault. Maybe the Corkscrew Moonsault. Yeah, I like that. This is the sprint. This is when you're running. Just kidding. I never understood what that was for. I guess that one will set you up, though. I kind of like this. I, I think I did that before, too. Arabian Press. That's fun. No, you got to bounce. You got to springboard. What the? <laughs> What's going on? It's broken. <laughs> is it still like that? It's just glitching. That's funny. This is basically a stunner. That's lame. YOLO. Alright, we'll do that. Okay. And then we'll just finish this up. Shooting star. Yeah. I hate the faints. They're so dumb. I'm actually wanting to do something. There you go. All right. Okay, guys. I know I've been doing this way too long. That's enough for me for now. What up, legend? How you doing? Glad you could join us. Glad you could join us. We got to get to the action. Okay, I think we're it. Let's actually continue our progress with Samuel. It's wow. not Samuel, Dan. Look who it is. Sammy, what happened to your neck? Don't get cute with me. You know exactly what happened. I had no idea who I was facing, and as a result, I lost, suffering emotional and physical damages after you assaulted me with that safe. I am going to sue you for everything you're worth. I'd rather take you on in the ring than in the courtroom, but it doesn't look like you're in any condition to do that. No, I'm not. Thanks to you and your shenanigans. But maybe we can work something out. I won't sue under the following conditions. First, when I'm ready, I get a rematch for my title. You're allowed that anyway. And second, you no longer use the safe as part of your entrance as it will cause further emotional distress, putting me at an unfair disadvantage. I actually already told management I was done with the safe. Anyway, just let me know when you're ready to lose to me again. I will, but it won't be a loss for me. And in the meantime, I have one other condition to prevent legal action. 
first, you must face my hand-picked opponent so I can rest up and do some extra scouting. Sure. Who do you want me to go up against? Oh, you'll find out in the ring. Not a great feeling when you don't know who you're facing, is it? Good luck. Oh, you actually get his neck brace. This is the story confirmation problem. We give you relevant information to the story, such as the rewards gain and completion. You always have the option to confirm or back out. Decide to confirm you'll be locked into a story and can no longer take on other stories until you finish the current one. Feel like you want to explore a little more or customize. You can always decline and come back. Well, let's go. Alright, guys. We'll see what we can get done. Is my rise really eight hours? See, that's what I mean. They can spout all they want. 50 hours this. 1,000 matches that. I think it's going to be different for each one, but... You know. We'll see. It's I'll... a superstar who's a lock to be on top of WWE for years to come. I want to see if they... Like, how's that? The following contest. Is scheduled for one fall, making his way to the ring. I'm in the way. From Canada, weighing in at 220 pounds, the WWE Intercontinental Champion, Daddy. Q. <laughs> Intercontinental titles don't grow on trees unless you're WWE's new golden boy. Is that jealousy I'm hearing, Corey? Yes. Corey's always the guy who's got a shit talk I mean they're cheering they like the lock and key All right. I'm really choked that it's not daddy like that shit writes itself bro I swear I read up that my rise was 50 hours there you go that's much better that forearm Ridge Holland Looks like Rich Holland has company, though. Sami Zayn has apparently opted to rehab his neck at ringside. Buckle up, folks. So they've actually kind of designed it. For grabs, but his reputation would certainly take a hit if he takes a step backwards here. Springboard. Oh! Absolutely throwing all caution to the wind. Spinning in the face of danger. One second. I, I one thing I want to just double check. Um, I I forget how to pick him up. Like lift. Oh, do you actually just hit L one? Like where you grab after pressing, initiate. It's R one, and that's what I thought. I I thought that's what I thought I was doing. So you grab and then R one in a direction. Okay, that's what I was looking for. What are you thinking? Well, no one lied to me, Leo. I'm just telling you. I read it. I didn't actually. Obviously not about the rest count, Cole. So man, maybe the article was wrong. He leaves the ring, but he could lose this match by count out. Momentum on the side of the lock. The lock isn't holding anything back. Ooh. Oh, ouch. He knows how to do it. That one busted up Rich. Delivered into the barricade. Well, let me do a move. There you go. No reversal. No reversal. Getting his ass kicked. Attempt to pin him. He's back into the ring. Oh, Sammy's right there. I didn't even notice Sammy was there. Shushing him. He can take on the world right now. Ref still counting. Close to calling it. Hurry back in. Rich Holland letting his Why? Yes, he didn't come here to watch him both in time. What a dummy. He certainly looked in command at the moment. Just going for the pin. Sammy Zane just blinds with my lock. This was all a setup to weaken the Intercontinental Champion before he faces Sammy Zane. Obviously. Did Sammy say something about the safe? Could be some kind of revenge for what happened when the lock debuted. 
With the deranged Sami Zayn calling the shots, nothing is off limits. Well, whatever the plan is, Sami looks to be maneuvering the lock toward the stage. And the lock's helpless after taking that blow from his own chain. And there it is. Ridge Holland has brought out the lock safe. What the heck is their plan? Belly to belly suplex on the unforgiving stage. But they don't have the, they don't now have the password. Do? Oh and my safe god. The safe over on top of the lock. Bro, that would hurt you so much. Pounds. This is way worse than what the lock did to Sammy. Our Intercontinental Champion is going to be seriously I got to reverse this. this. I'm going to have to go back and redevelop and shit. I, think I, can watch this. I did this by myself with Sammy in it. Let's go, game. No part of him. Well, no idea if these two are friends. Maybe Slade just didn't want to see someone get squashed. Well, Lock certainly looks frustrated with himself or Gabriel Slade or maybe all of the above. Why am I mad at he him? Just be happy. He's walking out of here on his own two feet and not getting peeled off the stage. You had a friend in Gabe. Slade. You got a friend in Slade. When they're pushing that 1K safe and your miles and your miles from saving your own ass. Yeah. So I wonder how many chapters there actually are then. Because this counts as a chapter. <laughs> Trying to commit murder on live television. Yeah, exactly. How did it feel to have your life flash before your eyes? Probably not great, especially since your life has been pathetic and worthless, unlike mine. I had a feeling better, Samuel. But if you and your goon should have taken me out, you and, but you and your goon should have taken you out when taken me out when you had the chance. Now you're going to pay. All right, how we doing? Better safe than sorry. There might be some more in here. How many more challenges are there? None. I've done all the challenges for this chapter. There's still, like, the optional. All right, big Gabe. Hey, you okay? It was almost really bad. Thanks for the assist, but I'm fine. It might not have looked like it, but I had things under control out there. Really? It looked more like you were about to get flattened by a thousand pounds safe. I respect you wanting to handle your own business, but I meant it when I told you I'd have your back. Oh. Look, let's get this straight. I like to do things on my own. It's gotten me this far. Take it from someone who's been here a while. That's not gonna cut it in WWE. And whether you want my help or not, I heard we're teaming together next week against Sammy and Ridge Holland. Fine. I guess we can team up for one night. Do you want to talk strategy or anything? I'll see you in the ring next week. That seems kind of irresponsible. Roger. After facing Sami Zayn and Ridge next week at Raw, Dan will get to choose how he defends his Intercontinental Championship against Zayn. Seriously, why? The guy ambushes me and steals my title, and now he's calling the shots on how he gets to defend it? Might have to look into pursuing legal action again, this time against Shawn Michaels in WWE. I see privilege, justice for Sammy. You can't start your own justice for Sammy, you know, hashtag trend. It doesn't work that way, Big Blue. But apparently it does. Just remember what Sammy said. Oh, yeah, he went, he made a heel turn, didn't he? The Sammy, the Uso thing? I, I don't know. I remember I remember that storyline. It's been a hot second. It's the man who might transform WWE I just want to see WWE something again. Forever. The lock. The lock and the key. Eat. The following contest is a tag team match set for... Got to make sure you tweet me out. Introducing first from Canada. Weighing in at 220 pounds, the WWE Intercontinental Champion, Daddy Dan Q. I'd be like, you're not uh, making me say WWE that name. WWE <laughs> debut, the lock is looking to build on his early moment. Just remember what Daddy Dan Q said. <laughs> I want my princess fanny pack. 
I usually turn off entrances. I really should have. It's been a non-stop thrill ride ever since the Intercontinental Champion stepped foot in WWE, and there's no reason to think it'll stop tonight as the Lock and Gabriel Slade take on Sami Zayn and Ridge Holland. The Lock locked horns with Sami Zayn on his first night in WWE and can't seem to shake Sami. That's way too long of a move. Horns, huh? You need to unlock some new vocabulary. No, Cody, they give you... I, I put them on. They just get... For story purposes, this is the persona they give you. Oh, whoops. Sorry, I got... I forgot. This has to be... I wonder if I should just leave myself here. Superstar. Sammy predicted that. He's able to sidestep there. Got it. Sammy has countered. Evading offense. Elbow smash. Oh, I thought I could. Oh, I mistimed that one. Setting up. Nice suplex. Looking to catch him off. Really? No, kick out. Too soon for a cover. And the gear. See ya. Whoa! <laughs> so much air. Seeking missile coming at you. And the explosion occurring ringside. Oh man, meeting the barricade. Boom! He's returning fire. Pretty drop kick. Oh my gosh, a follow-up moonsault slam. And that was a successful bit of offense with that maneuver. I gotta get him out. <laughs> That's finding any which way to topple the competition. Hurling your own body like that is insane. Three. Look at this. Oh, I missed. That's a bad landing. A totally ill-advised decision there. Maybe slight hesitation there caused the outcome. Oh, he got he goaded me. <laughs> Sound like someone went, the the but it's it's because it's because female rep. Oh, I waited for the timing and I messed it up. The twisted bliss T-shirt's pretty slick. Little Miss Bliss. Clean tag for his partner. Different gimmick. Get up, get up, get up. What a move! He bumped him slightly. Uh -oh, uh -oh. What a bash. No. Shrugging off the pin like it's nothing. And after this match is already gone for so long. What the hell? Throw him in the corner. Let's get Gabe in here. Get him into the corner. Tag is made. What do these two have in store? He's fresh. Flying shoulder block. Drops a knee. My, my player won't get out of the ring. Oh. Nice amateur takedown. All the way over. Drops the hammer. Right on the lower back. He's oh. absorbed some damage already. Grabs the leg. Look at this. He just tossed the leg. Oh, God. Please get up. Punch. Right on the wow, what a punch. Ridge prevents that from connecting. Stop taunting, you oh, prick. Continuing to work on the arm with a, and a carefully measured knee drop. Oh, missed it. Oh, man, look at this power. Gets the tap. Oh, you are a lucky bish. Gets caught with a punch. Ooh. 
You know, Sammy's in worse shape, so this is good. Ref, get out of the way! Take it to move, whatever it might be. I don't, oh, he reversed it. Oh, impressive counter. oh wrong button. Oh, I didn't get the. Oh, no! That's really weird. I preferred the bar. I wonder if I can change that. Hold on. Options. Uh, gameplay settings. Uh, no. Presentation? Huh, maybe you can't. Maybe that's out of the game. Or out of the level. Look out! suplex. Rich Hall with that fighting Yorkshire grit. Maybe, 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 maybe. Got it! He's in now. Finally. Oh, and I'm annihilated. Oh, not not enough. This match is getting pushed beyond the normal limits. It's a little weird, Adam. The new kickout system. I gotta get you. I'm sure I'll get used to it. What? Some filth. I hate that one. That's an easy reversal. It's like one of the easiest ones to time. Yeah, that's what I figured. The ref's count ain't stopping. The clock is ticking here. Oh man, by the, the ref keeps getting in the way of our shit. Oh, I hate this move. It's a little bit faster. He's able to fend off the attack. flying He's got the target acquired. Just a matter of moments. Come on. Yes. Yep. Well, he's going to celebrate all night long. Here are your winners. Daddy, Dan, Q, and Gabriel Slate. And the winners celebrating together. Great chemistry. Wow, it's quiet. Tonight. Two minds working as one in the... Man, it's been a while since I played that one, so... So, these interviews for the doc will be quick and easy. It's just like we're having a conversation. I've seen these before. I get it. Okay, good. So, a lot to catch up on. You debuted on Raw, won the IC title, almost got squashed by a half-ton safe, but then were rescued by an unlikely ally in Gabriel Slade. I appreciated the assist, but I wouldn't go as far as to say we're allies. Okay, let's not get hung up on semantics. Nonetheless, Sami Zayn was not happy that Shawn Michaels gave you the choice of how you'll defend your Intercontinental Championship. Is there any merit to Sami's complaints? I know I'm new here, but I also know that Sami Zayn will find a way to complain about anything. That's true. I once heard him complain that the production crew's box dinners were bland and uninspired. Really? Oh, okay, that was me. But you get the idea. Anyway, what's your choice for the rematch against Sammy? And give me some flavor, if you don't mind. 
you know, my, um, last man standing ladder matches are so stressful, but let's do it. Sammy wants to talk about privilege. Well, he's going to have the privilege of having a 10 foot ladder jammed down his throat. Boom, mic drop. What's up, Aiden? Doing good. How are you? All right. Well, we'll see if are we still locked in. Yeah, we are still in the story. The following is a ladder match. Something's gonna go wrong. That is for the WWE Intercontinental Championship. It's the superstar who's a lock to be on top of WWE for years to come. Making his way to the ring from Canada, weighing in at 220 pounds. Oh, I thought it was something else. Maybe not. So we're actually going to compete in this ladder match. They don't like Sammy in this. Sammy smells like cheese. Sammy smells like cheese. I mean, what? Ooh, kill him. Oh, I, my hands were off the controller. That's on me. And what a matchup as the Intercontinental Champion defends his title against his biggest nemesis in WWE, Sammy Zayn. My only nemesis. nemesis in WWE? Who's the lock's second biggest nemesis? Give me a break, Cole. The key. The guy just got here like 10 minutes ago. Well, he's already made more of a mark in the ring in 10 minutes than you did in 10 years. Oh, bye, 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 bye. Extra marks on Sammy tonight. Big forearm. Put him on there. Oh, that would have been sick if I did. There's going to be some cool moves I want to do. Reversal. Can he take advantage? And this match will head back to the ring. Oh, it didn't work. I wouldn't be surprised if he turns into a catapult here. Those are folding chairs, but they can also fold you in half. He'll take things into the ring. He skirts away, living to fight another day. I'm not trying to set it up. I guess the only thing left to do is climb it. Zane looking helpless to every attack. A killer instinct from the lock is shining through. And returning to the ring. Oh, I missed. They give you such a... Oh, I missed it. Pump handle. What the... What is going on here? Oh, my goodness. You have to question what kind of malintent is behind a power bomb with that much force. And the gear finds its mark. Honestly, once again... Ooh, harsh kick. Strikes with a kick. He's taking Once again, the these things are annoying to set up. Grab it! Nice. That'll either wake you up or knock you out. A drop kick in the corner. Perfectly executed. He won't grab it right now. He won't grab the ladder. Got a flying form smash. It keeps grabbing the... See, he keeps grabbing that. I'm trying to grab the fucking. Sammy Zane's game plan. Vicious right forearm. Stop doing that. Oh, timely counter by Zane, and that might be the start of the. Oh, that's annoying. I probably could have ran away. Hoping to start a rush of his own with that attack. Just like that, Sammy gets stopped. I tried to do the comeback. Check this this again? Blow your mind. I don't know. Just a whole lot of dancing around. Oh, that was one of those power bombs that would shorten someone's career. Oh my god, my reversals are not on key, on key right now. Right to the spine. Oh, that was 
kind of on the. Uh, He's feeling the effects of that last hit. I'm bleeding. Okay, leave, bro. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. He's heading back to the ring. I want to try and run up and jump on him, but it's always such an absolute pain in the ass to set up. God, I wonder what he's thinking about when he sets it up here. See what I mean? Like, you have to, like, be walking into it. Oh, I wish you would, Sammy. I wish you would. No, 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 get up. It's going down, boys. Oh! <laughs> Let's go. Oh, man, I love it. Taking this one back to the ring now. Oh, boy, he's talking him. Watching for an opening. Oh, it's supposed to do that. That's rude. Uh, springboard. Corkscrew moonsault. Just See, I, I want to be able to run up it, but it doesn't always work. Guts and accuracy as well. Oh, you reversed it. Oh, my God. That was really good, John. Thanks for asking. Battling ringside, and our announce table's getting shaky. That's because Byron is quivering. I had to wait for that animation. I get nervous when the fight comes out here, guys. Now Zane sent to the outside with authority. But he's still got to climb the ladder. That's the only way this match ends. It's not in the right spot. Okay, he's re-entering the ring. Oh, I hate that animation, bro. Tossed into the Dude, I have I I reversed that. That's garbage. If I were him, I'd climb. But now he's gonna glitch. Uh-oh. I'm gonna take an L. I'm stunned. I can't reverse. No, I missed it. So many times in the past. He eludes the cop. Following moves up. Wow. And just like that, he said crashing to the floor. Why would I want the chair? Wedging the chair into the turnbuckles. Oh shit. See, it sets it up in the wrong... That's in the wrong spot. Maybe I'll be able to get it, though. Into the chair! Climb it. How do you climb it? Oh, there you go. They changed it. Climb! Go for it! Climb! Oh, that's lame as hell. How do you grab it? Oh, fuck, they changed so many things. Iron is hot. Questionable timing of this move, Cole. He's got that ladder right where he wants it. Now what? They don't look now that that ladder is lined up. Oh, what happened? Oh, out of the ladder. Pick it up. It's in the wrong spot. It's so annoying. Dude, I want it in the fucking middle. God, they made it even worse. 
Like, why is it there? Oh, my God. 2K. Fix your shit. Like, it goes where it wants to go. It doesn't matter. But it's possible that... Oh, he's up quick. Making the climb here. Maybe... They probably kept this exactly the same. Looking to end this thing right now. Oh, we go. Hey, he, he can win it here. We'll have some wistful thinking going on. Oh, God. The prize in hand, but the ladder's gone. The only question is, how bad do you want it? Unless they simplified it like that so you can kind of grab it. He's setting up the ladder now. But can he get up there in time? That's the... Here's Zane sent flying. I don't know. Climbing the ladder at this point seems it to won't be let me do it. Oh, there you go. It's never too early to try. Got a hold of it. Yeah, let's see how long that lasts. Guys, I'll be amazed. Got it. This is where the match ends. And the lock can still hold the title. Lock got the key. The they shortened the mini game. Did you see that? Here is your winner. champion daddy Dan Q and they have now been forever immortalized with their win here in this hellacious ladder match word Sammy Zayn I interrupted him anyway I think we're gonna get a cutscene right off the bat I wonder if you lost it if it, ch it changes things up I think it does because there's different choices and things like that so if I said so they basically want you to do a heel and a face, basically, for each one. All right, Shawn Michaels, there you go. The Miz. <laughs> oh, Miz, you look hilarious, bro. All right, I have 24 upgrade points. That might be enough to get another aerial running boost. It is, so I'm going to boost myself to an 8, because I do that a lot. Socials. There is a story. And there's a couple of these as well. Okay, well, we might as well do some of these. Nice double over Sam. You gave him some momentum. Might have a big op. Call your title fence. Impressive. And you did it all by yourself. Stayed up late to watch a big win. Really stuck it to Sammy. Reminded me of the time I was facing Cactus Jack. And who? Tavish? So I fell asleep, like I said, late night. Going to get some rest. That's not how it works, bro. Congratulations on your new success in WWE, but we have been alerted by your legal team that you have one final match left on your PWJ contract. Oh, man. So I got to go back and do, like, uh, the little times. Sort of busy here, if you haven't noticed. But that's probably exactly why you're reaching out now, isn't it? It won't hurt to have a big WWE star in our ring, but contracts are contracts. And one more thing. It'll be a tag team match. You'll need to find your own partner. Can I count on you? Sure. Deals to deal. I'll make it work. This is optional. Anything optional we're doing. Who are you going to team with? Ask Gabe Slade. Trust me, tag matches are annoying enough as it is. Unfinished business. At least they've, like I said, at least they've made this way more, like, accessible. Because in the last game, they didn't. It was kind of like you had to try and guess how to unlock it. And some of them went ununlocked. You didn't need them, necessarily. But a lot of them ended up staying locked. And it's like, well, that's annoying. I know we're playing the lock and the key. All right, big old Gabe. You're usually much happier to be in catering. What's on your mind? Can't get anything by you. I actually need to ask a pretty big favor. Lay it on me, partner. Easy on the partner talk, okay? Come on, Apparently, man. Take I still a have a tag match left on my old PWJ contract. Will you make the trip over and team up with me? Trust me, I really didn't want to ask you. You really know how to make a guy feel wanted. Nothing personal. I'm just not too big on asking for help. I get it, and I got you. I'm in. This is where you say thanks? Right. I'll see you over there. I don't even know how to turn the... I kind of want to see this one, though. Go to Japan. Just heard the news. 
that Dan and Gabe are coming to Japan for one last match. Sounds like a premise of a bad buddy cop movie that's about to bomb. Get your popcorn ready, Chosen. No popcorn for me. I'll see in the ring. Uh, this is pretty cool. And everybody's white for some reason. Yeah, I'll be doing the other one as well, John. On my fanny pack, it's Daddy Dan! But my fanny pack is clipping. Look at this clip. No! Daddy! Oh, man. I wish we could do music. They really should have, like, instead of just doing creator safe mode and muting all the music, they should just have an option. I mean, I'm glad they do that. That way you know certain scenes are no good or, you know. Oh, wow. I think I would have seen that coming. Oh, Jay Pierce. He was from the last game. Damn, he's getting a mud hole stomped. Sound like I broke bones. I don't like the celebration. Uh, let's get my boy in here. The double team maneuvers are kind of risky sometimes because they're pretty easily reversed. A lot of times on the harder difficulties, they just spam reverse. Like these guys are reversing everything. It doesn't make sense. Oh, come on with that. Am I supposed to be bleeding with that? I got the hot tag. He wanted me to. He wanted him in. We flew all the way to Japan for this. He just got like these big knockout blows, doesn't he? Stop a mud hole. Tell your boy's a striker. Oh, he's bleeding. That dropped you, hey? <laughs> Just pelted him. All 
Alright, no reversals, no reversals. No whammies. Hopefully my player comes in to reverse this. No. She they know. He doesn't have that ability. Oh man. That was weak. Jumping early. The possum attack. I gotta try those. Okay. Why are you taunting right now, bro? Let's try and go for the pin. I don't think it's enough, but he is hurt. No, it's not. It's some written in guy in the Japanese circuit. I still clipped him. Quick, 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 let's get the spear in. I think that's game over. Come on, he's still stunned. There's no way. Oh, man, hey. Ah, those pricks timed it wrong. See, he, I might have got him there. Well, I got it yesterday, but I'm, I started it today. Ooh, good reversal. I think it's just a wrench move. I don't think, yeah, it's not a submission. Really? Oh, you got out of it. It's kind of annoying. I mean, it's funny. His Chosen's actually quite hurt. Why? It didn't switch again. It did the wrong move. Oh, I didn't want to. I didn't want to select him. Oh, I have no more. Guys, I had no more stamina. I was ready to hit him with a finisher. That would have been perfect. What's up, Michael? Oh, I lost the finisher. He reversed it. I had to get up quickly for that. That was a good move.
Go for the pin. Quickie stun. Damn. Go for it. Come on, call it. Finally, man, that was a long match. But he was so debuffed after everything, there's no way he's getting it. What's up, Pius? How you doing? All right, that's your optional match. The challenges give you uh, stats, I find, where optional matches are just extras, I think. I don't know if they give you experience. We'll find out in a second. Oh, you get upgrade points out of that. So let's go back to our texts then. What's our attribute upgrade? Seven. That's not enough for anything other than, you know. That's, you know what? That's weird that... It's not showing as complete. That's kind of annoying, honestly. But it'll it'll go away. You may have won, but you've clearly lost your eyesight. That gear was somehow even worse than your lock attire. <laughs> what, you don't like my fanny pack, bro? Why are you hating? Safe with the lock. Whoever wrote this is fired. Alright. Update. Rick Boogs, WWE, has been tearing it up ever since Liv Morgan became his tour manager. So much that he earned a shot of the Intercontinental title. Oh, yeah, we've been making beautiful music together, all right. Newest power ballad couple is here. Next stop on tour, an IC title match. How about it? You get it? ready to get rocked? I'm ready to face it. Let's go. Rock and roll. See you on stage, champ. Jesus. All right, time for a bit of elbow dropping. Popping, locking, and elbow dropping. You guys know how it is. I feel if you only focus on the main story, you could have this done pretty quick. But if you're doing all the side content, which I think you should, you know, take the time. Yeah, I got. I got to remember to turn that off. Introducing the challenger from Madison, Wisconsin, weighing in at 234 pounds, Rick Boobies. Rick Boobies. Weighing in at 220 pounds, he is the WWE I'm like teabagging an individual. Champion, Daddy Dan Q. That's sweet. Continental Championship, one of the most prestigious titles. In I mean, it's up to you, Epic. I'm still, I'm still early on in it. It's very similar to the previous games, but this one seems more organized. The lock is facing one of his but, title defenses. I mean, I say if you like the. the red oh, we both. Boots. That's embarrassing. Boots new tour manager Liv Morgan will be looking to add to their recent momentum by adding Intercontinental Gold to their gold records. I'm Good supposed to. This is one of those mandatory. You'd know about that sort of thing, wouldn't you, Corey? From the middle row. So did he miss right that? The kidneys from behind. He steers clear of contact. Uh-oh, what's happening? Hold oh, we got it. We got someone coming in. Why? Second thoughts, or someone hit a wrong button. Either this is just a distraction. Out. He's got his finisher. I reversed it. The challenger's looking shaken. He had to be prepared to take some damage tonight. And the lock has picked up the pace. The lock's showing that edge, that ruthlessness. Man, I'm working him right now. It's easy to get the reversal when you're trying to maneuver them in there. Evades their offense. Done. Standing shooting star press incredible. A 
agility oh. like that is what can set you apart from the rest of the locker room. Boom! You hear the impact. Compromised position here. Damn, my timing was all... Oh, Jesus! This one is headed to the outside, not by choice. Get up, get up. Hard to come back from that kind of impact. Ducks through, up and over, Celia Del Sol. I know it's not. Oh, head first. Yeah, I saw that. There's only, but it depends how long. They need to be aware of a count out right now. There are plenty of ways battling in this area. It could end in serious harm. He returns to the right. Oh, what happened? I had a finisher. It wouldn't let me use it. Staggering to his feet, but he won't like what's coming next. A championship. Yeah, they have Winnipeg. They have they have places where popular wrestlers are from. Like they have Calgary, right? Hart family. Winnipeg is um this animation is exactly the same from last year. Um Daddy. Winnipeg because of uh, Chris Jericho, so perhaps the Toronto from everybody else who's from that region. What's funny is you have Chris Benoit, but Chris Benoit's been kind of like stricken from the record with these. Um, Chris Benoit was from Edmonton. I mean, well, technically he was born in Montreal and then they, his family moved here. He was like maybe like, I don't know, a few months old or something like that. Why did your music hit? I'm so sorry. I don't know why my music hit during your match. It's so weird. Oh, good. It didn't really affect the outcome. Really? Boogs didn't even notice? I thought that would get his attention. <laughs> Not that I want it. Oh, okay. I see what's going on here. You've got a little thing for Boogs, huh? Well, he is extremely handsome. And who knows, maybe someday we could make a little boo drop. I honestly don't know how to respond to that, other than to remind you that Liv Morgan is more than just Boogs' manager, if you know what I mean. Well, that's also sort of why I'm here. I heard a rumor that Liv has actually been talking about moving on to you. Are you interested at all? Yeah, I don't really know her, but maybe. Well, I think you should grant Boogs a rematch and I'll be your manager. Let me work my matchmaking magic from ringside. What do you say? Uh, manager's not really my style, sorry. But good luck making a gumdrop or a little booger. Or... <laughs> booger. Yeah, because these aren't multi-story things, are they? It's just one match and that's it. Oh, no, it is. There, this is a storyline. Sorry, guys. The unexpected musical interruption. Boogs has been granted Intercontinental title rematch. It's going to be one hell of an encore performance. My bad. What has she done? Sammy, what's the deal, man? Honestly, can we just come together we're both canadian you know one of us is handsome uh i mean don't let that bug you i mean we could still be friends and stuff you know everyone needs the uh, oh you're going now okay damn it i keep forgetting to turn on off turn off entrances rick booger well this is familiar isn't it it's the intercontinental champion the lock Title <laughs> we did the Boogs same thing last time. time on Raw. You'd think Boogs and Liv Morgan of all people would have had a handle on the music last week. I guess technical problems happened to the best of us. Sweet, simple Saxton. My money's on the down. Really? On the line. He manages to make it barely a one count. Just using the cover to drain out some energy. Oh man, my reversal time is trash. Drops the hammer. Shoulders down. Championship on the line. This one's far from over. 
He might just be trying to frustrate his opponent a little with that attempt. Owie. Down the opponent. Daddy. And Zagiri finds its mark. Oh, ouch. No. Ridiculous standing shooting. Oh, for God's sake, girl. Are you coming out again, Dewdrop? She's actually here, though. This again. Never mind. It looks like Dewdrop actually showed up this time. And she's distracting the Intercontinental Champ. Didn't matter. I'm going to throw him out. Reversals, reversals, and more reversals. Oh, I tried to time it. That one's a little bit tougher. Something's going to happen, and then this is going to turn into like a Liv Morgan storyline. It's not letting me. Oh, there you go. Concerned about anyone else's well being. Heads out of the ring, but needs to be mindful. Hold on, I gotta see it again. I don't want to do the lift one, I just want to do the drag. I always forget how to do that. Um, after initiate carry, I don't want to carry, I just want to like, I just want to move them. You know what I mean? Initiate drag, that's it, it's L. Okay, that's what L1. I knew it was something like that. Come over here. Thank you. This match is filled out to the ringside area. And as we can see, tensions are not what I wanted to do. So annoying. I hit the button to put them on the table, but he didn't get put on the table. He can't win the title. The thing is, it's in my advantage to be outside the ring. I was hoping to put them. Come here, buddy. The referee continues. The count may call it soon. Placing them right where they want them into the corner. Oh man! Here we go. Superplex. This could go south in a hurry. Wu Tang. You don't always, do you? Was a long way down. Oh God. He might be right, actually. I forgot, you used to be able to break them. I'm thinking of, my brain is still on like old game. You used to be able to not only just do the finisher through the table, but you used to be able to just like j like throw them on it and then go to the top rope and jump through it. I thought you still could have done that, but yeah, you're right. They did change that a while ago. No reversal. What the fuck? Oh my gosh, a follow-up moonsault slam? I'll just do that. I was going to put him to the table, but it's just too much effort. Let's just get rid of him. What's up, Spider? How is he up for... Oh, he used his move. I can't tell if it's anger in the eyes of the fact that he has his... He's not hurt enough. I didn't realize there were these actual, like, longer storylines. Oh, that's a waste. Oh, I was too slow. What? Proves to be costly there. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. Connecting with a sharp elbow. Boone's looking to rock, but he's got to stay on his man here. He's back. Come on, Booger. So we can put him back down. 
No rope break. Let's get it. I don't know if this is going to go anywhere, like, story-wise, but I guess we'll see. Because it's it just, I don't know. It seems a little... Um, there's too many unknowns. There's too many unknowns, guys. Daddy! <laughs> I officially challenged me to another rematch on behalf of my new client. Have you lost your mind, doo-doo? Boogs already has a manager. Thank you very much. That doesn't seem to be working out so great, Liv. Which is why I'm stepping in. I just care so darn much about my Boog. Unlike some people. It just gets crazy and crazier. Boog, school, you please set the record straight. Was hoping you could actually do that for me. Just heard that you and Dan have been seeing each other. First time I've heard that one. That makes two of us. I wonder where you got that intel. I'm trying to read it. Feels like Dewdrop's the only person looking out for me here. She even lobbied to get me that rematch. You're fired. What? Wow, okay. You'll regret this one. Dewdrop reveals the true colors. Well, I'm guessing now Liv is going to be in my corner. You want to see my true colors? How about a mixed tag match between me and Booger and to you and your new guy? You in? Let's clean this mess up. I'm in. All right, guys. It's time for the Booger. Unless it, like, chains. Oh, there's Liv there. So I, I'm in a story right now. So come on, Liv. You only live once. Do you have anything to do with Dewdrop's deranged lies about me? Nah, fam. Why would I? Why? So, I take it you don't have a huge crush on me. Nope. But I am down to team up with you to rearrange Dewdrop's lying face. Yeah, that makes two of us. So you didn't want me dripping in chocolate? <laughs> or was that just another lie? No, that, that was true. <laughs> oh. But that's it. Just just the chocolate. Nothing just purely platonic. It's not what you think. I just like witnessing human beings in chocolate. <laughs> so stupid. These two together? Together? These are some strange bedfellows. I'll say. And their opponents, Rick Boos and Do this is not the usual pairing you would see, Corey. Maybe there's some cause for concern. I don't want to see if they do anything different, like, for their entrance, but not really. It's musical chair madness here on Raw, as allegiances have been upended. And new I always do that with Rick. He always blocks. That's right, well, now I got to... Why am I this hurt? Works for me. She's considered a heavyweight, I think, so... I won't be able to lift her as Liv. Please, don't start calling them... Ladies and gentlemen, I give you Boo Wow, she is spamming. This can't be legal. Oh, and a match slam. I got no whammies right now. It's not letting me reverse. The AI just spams moves. She gets the tag. That means her opponent. Alright, this isn't a good start for me. I haven't put anything in. He's just reversing and blocking everything. We're gonna see it. Go, go for the cover. Really? Man, I'm getting my ass whooped. And a kick out. I think because this is probably the finale of the storyline. I wouldn't hit me if I were you, girl. From the heavens, you never know. You can you can hit them on the side. I don't think they fixed it. Like if I were to attack a uh, do right now, I think you spear them off and you can get away with it. You have in past games, but I don't want to risk that right now. Getting tossed. Hit to the top now. Sky high. Look out, Boo! That's gravity taking a break. Look out, Boo! Low. Oh, you reversed it. Just in time. Off the barricade. All right, Booger. Come on. Oh, what a right. Yeah, that's some attitude behind Oh, I hate that trash. At least he didn't just chuck my legs away. At least he did some move. Typical guy hiding behind his woman. <laughs> what? <laughs> 
Running clothesline. Come on, Liv. Got to use your speed. Dude, wasn't there a storyline with Liv Morgan in the last game too? I don't know, Jacob. It's so far, it's just kind of a set story. Dude, I can't touch her. Look, it's just like. Oh! She doesn't have that ability. Leave it alone! Leave it alone! Oh, right to the back! The cake softened the blow. Like, why does she sound so weird when she says three? Oh, dude, don't touch her. I just helped her up. By her neck. That's how you help a lady up in me. <laughs> By the neck. Stop running away. Look at Liv go. So determined. And Dewdrop looks fairly shaken up by that. All reversal. And yeah, it's about time to heavily consider tagging in that. Is it enough? She's quick to get her shoulder up. She just shocked everyone in the ring. Got her before she could tag him in. She's staying elusive. Nice cross. Oh, the headbutt! Man, she ain't fucking about. The head like a but yeah, in terms of storyline, we might actually go somewhere else. I don't really know. They have set stories instead of... It's a little more organized, but it's more linear at the same time, so... She's in a like, in the last one, it was a bit of a cluster because you, you were trying to do all these missions alongside the brands, and it was just not really... I prefer when they actually have a storyline for us to kind of follow, but we can still... You know. Okay, what's Liv's finisher right now? Uh, let's see. Uh, Oblivion. Oblivion. Running strike versus ropes. Standing front running. Okay, well, let's get her up as soon as we do that. Multiple curb stops. There it is. Into Liv ending this fight right there. She kicks it. I don't believe it. Dewdrop with incredible amounts of fight still left in her. And Liv Morgan truly thought she Why is it targeting the wrong person? Tag team wrestling. Tag team wrestling. Like, what are you talking? Well, who's chanting that? Does she have this ability? No, she doesn't. Let's get that perk. Come on, dude, dude, get in here. She's debuffed. But she's also buffed at the same time. For Morgan, this is all of Dujon's fortitude getting tested, and the attacks up there must be taking their toll. Her vision's got to be seeing some dark spots at this point. Dujon avoids. Oh, reversal. These guys have been oh. each other up for a while, and now it's their chance. Ooh, oh, he's. That's kind of a dirt. That was greasy. Oh, I was ready for it. I still missed it. Don't squat. I hate this move. It's so annoying. Just like flick the dick right there. Really? All right. Here we go. Let's try her other finisher. Bro, that... 
Oh, see, yeah, you can't attack. Awesome pin. This is going to be tough. The mixed tag, this is what's really going to take some time. She tagged out. That's fine. Me, I think her opponent wanted a break too. Nicely done. And that was a well-executed attack. Ooh. Grab him. What is that, man? You guys got to don't squat. Oh, for crying out loud. It's just a waste of everybody's time. Frankensteiner. Oh no, that wasn't Frankensteiner. Oh, what happened there? It's that time in the match where we all take a trip. That could be I just use resiliency to get out. I don't want to lose this one. Climbing up top, he's got big plans. Got a reverse. Up high. No reversal option there. All right, God damn it, bro. Boog's excitement level. Oh, just deadlifting their opponent. Tucks him aside. He's starting to struggle here. No reversal is available. Of a tag team is. Don't be afraid to use the resources and oh, every time I'm messing up. it up. Am I being diplomatic enough, Cole? Just look at Boogs gain the momentum in this one. Yeah, Boogs with impressive offense. Ooh. And he's able to counter. Could be what he needed to admit. His eyes are fixated. He's looking to end this. But then I got to hope that Dewdrop doesn't break it up. See, how am I supposed to do this if I can't attack her? So it's like, what do I do? I can't actually target her. See, I can't attack her. That's the best I can do. Green. Okay, now bust him. Get up there, get up there. See, how am I supposed to do it? She's got a fighter. I probably can. See, there's nothing I can do about this, guys. I need Liv to do the deed. It's so annoying. We're gonna be, they, they still haven't fixed the issues with tag team matches. Though you gotta believe he'll be looking for the kill shot one more time. Turning the tables. Defenses are sharp in this series of reversals. He may get the three count right here. This is it. He wasted no time kicking out there. Could he not keep him down for even one at this point? These it's the same garbage. The bit, maybe I maybe I have to win out. it with women. Maybe I can attack the guys as a girl. I don't know. I should try. These two teams have gone to war, Cole. Of course they're gonna wind up with a few battle scars. Oh my god. Oh. 
Dewdrop on the receiving end. What a forearm. Oh, a forearm smack. Oh, that's Phil. That's disrespect. Ah, oh, possum. Where was the ref at? I just don't know what it's going to take. And now the tag resets the action as the men get set to do battle. Big flying form. Any more hits in that area could leave him dizzy. He tags out, which means it's now time for the women to compete. Uh-oh, this is not going to end well. No, I know how to do it, Sean, but you're not allowed to do it when it's men versus women. You're not allowed to switch. I, I've, I've already done it in this in this stream, but you can't have the women attack them. That's not how it works. Like, I can attack him. See, I can do that. So that's the only way. Let's see if we can finish it. So Liv has to win here. That should be it. Oh, she grabbed. That's annoying. Try it. Hey, Abdul. We're going to be here forever. The difference helping you stay alive deep into the match. She steers clear of that. Why, man? Like, you miss. You, like, it's supposed to. She gets the tag. That means her opponent has to leave the ring, too. Forearm smash. And the gear finds its mark. The only way we're going to win this on time is if we do this. Because if he reverses me when I go for the spear... This might be another way I can do it. Maybe I can do it this way. Nicely done. Oh, that's annoying. She was stunned. Jesus, guys. This is one way I can do it. Maybe if he's in here. There he goes, right into the corner. It's because she's not ready. Rick Boogs goes down low. And we're about to see. That's bad. She has to break this up or I lost. Yeah, that was important. He switches it back around. God damn it, bro. Nothing's working. We're just hitting air. He's burying elbows in the midsection. And Zakiri finds its mark. Typical guy hiding behind his woman. Go, that's it. That's got to be it. Come on. He's stunned. Thank you very much. High five. And Liv Morgan.
Man, I hate that kind of shit. We were that was like a 40 minute match. And we still have the optional ones to go through. Like certain stories are longer than a bag of shit. But hey, at least I know that. At least they like all these stories are decent length. So I know that I can do a chapter per story or per stream, you know what I mean? I can like spend my or take my time with it. You know? And I only got 10 upgrade points for that. I think there's only two more optional. Let's just go to the <laughs> Miz, I can't, I can't, I can't take seriously. What are we sitting at? We have 17. I don't have enough for anything except submission. So I have to do this. Let's see the socials. Congrats on the win. I'm proud of you. Think of this as a big welcome WWE lesson and you learn fast. Well, good luck here, my friend. Wow, she was actually nice about it. We're not friends. Save the hot air for Boogs. Oh, good riddance, Boogs. Excited for a fresh start. Feels even better after a win. Shout out to Dan for making rocking there with me. Anytime. All right, well. Yeah, this is done, right? So there's not going to be any... I can just go to stories. Stories. Okay, good. Okay, well, before we step... Let's actually look at the story progress. So it looks like there's two more... These two stories. This Know Your Role mission. Two more optionals. And then faction forming is the last one. So we have an idea here. Let's talk with Miz. Well, well. If it isn't the Intercontinental Champion. I remember my first IC title, but barely. Because I've had so many. <laughs> Losing your memory in your old age, huh? So sad. <laughs> wow. Locke's got jokes. And I was just about to teach you everything I know about being the Intercontinental Champ. Enlighten me. To be a true Intercontinental Champion requires a truly Intercontinental skill set with mastery of styles from all over the world. And your Intercontinental specialty is... British, Japanese, Lucha, Cleveland? Cleveland? No, no, no. I am the greatest French-style wrestler of all time, of course. A style defined by the element of surprise, or as the French say, surprise, with a zzz, which they stole from me. <laughs> Are you sure about that? My wife is French, so... I'd know. Okay. But enough spelling talk. She's not French. She's French Canadian. This very different. Is all about. There's a massive difference. In the ring for your title. What do you say? Dude, she, you don't say she's French. She's from she's from Quebec. God, the fucking Quebecois. They're so entitled. Sure. Sure. But I've got more important business first. I've already got a cage match title defense lined up. Well, bon chance, as the French would say. Break a leg or two. Les Mis. Miserable. Okay, hold on. I, I'll i be right back. Hopefully I don't mix. Well, I'm worried. There's still entrances, so that's good. I'll be right back. An impressive win over Mad Cat Moss. Here comes the man with a shot to the back. What the heck is he doing out here? And now the Miz is asking for the cage to be lowered down. This is absolute mayhem. The champion just survived a cage match, and now he's dealing with this. The champ's doing his best to battle back, but Miz has played the element of surprise to perfection. Can the champion capitalize on this opening? Low blow from the Miz. The most unpredictable man in sports entertainment has struck again. And again, and again, and again. Talk about a long night for the Intercontinental Champion. This is brutal. Wait, what happened? Oh, I missed the... Okay, good. Damn it. What did I miss? I missed something. I thought I was just going to get into the match. Shit, that was bad timing. Tell you what, let's do this. I'm going to watch it. <laughs> Wait, what the hell? One sec. 
I'll, I'm gonna just kind of see it. Wow. How did I manage that? Les Mis. Sorry, guys. Miserable. Okay, hold on. I, I'll, I'll be right back. Did I do I, that? I, well, I'm worried. There's I just assumed. So I should have waited back. until this. I'm sorry, guys. I'm going to watch. I'm watching it right now. Right as I leave, too. Oh, Miz. Oh, and then the cage came down. Okay. Can the champion capitalize Sorry guys, this is embarrassing. Just miss doing miss things. Guess it wasn't that bad, honestly. He just attacked me like an ass. Alright. Well, at least we know what happened. Okay, let's read this again. It won't let me... That's annoying. Alright, so... Because I know... You're not French! Wait, either you're French at all. Pretty sure Maurice is Canadian. Thank you. We're intercontinental. Yeah, you're annoying. I'm a final legit Canadian to help me shut you phonies up. Well, I'm a Canadian. Oh, Josie Jane was from last year. Wasn't she? I remember her. I remember that she was talking about being like related to the hearts or something like that. Oh, Leah, I might go with Natalia. Let's rock with it. I'm sure not my nature will have no problem putting you and Maurice in your place. Let's go back to the top. How'd you like to taste that French cooking? Oh, Lord, no. Is Miss talking about being the greatest French style wrestler of all time again? And since when is a sneak attack in a cage match French cooking? French Cajun style. Get it? Cajun. Yikes. Okay, that's all we missed. Wouldn't it be funny if Nat's like, no, I'm a little preoccupado. That's rude. That's pretty rude, man. That's Rick rude. So another mixed tag match, guys. The man destined to be top dog. It's the lock. I gotta turn these entrances off. We're doing this shit again, man. Since when are the Miz and Maurice French? I wouldn't second guess Miz Saxton. Not when it comes to maneuvering his way to another The only American here right now is the Miz. Bunch of maple syrup suckers in the ring right now. Real maple sucker. And able to beat an Italian to the punch. And that one misses the mark. Uh-oh. Maurice is out of the way. My goodness. Suplexes, slams, and bombs are all painful. But being Did I get oh I almost got there in time. It's humiliating. Oh, I thought I got the reversal. Come on. I'm gonna get the stun, man. I'm gonna be stunned. Well, Tyler, obviously I, I in the ring, bro. I didn't mean the entire chat. She probably didn't expect it to put her away there, but she's put her on notice. Maurice with a great shot. She's taking some big hits here. She's I'm having trouble with my reversals. Match, it's up to her if she wants to play it safe or keep fighting. Momentum is clearly against Italia now. Maurice isn't holding anything back. I got to do most of my work as Natalia. Just so I can attack Mizzy. Right when I'm ready to do it, I think I it's not going to pop like the reversal prompt. Oh, 
She scores big with the counter. And they just bust it out an impactful maneuver. What? See that kind of garbage, man. Gets up immediately. We gotta get back in the ring. Let's give it up for Maurice. Looking great no matter what she does. Oh, looking back for her here. Maurice fires back. Maurice is dominating me right now. Oh, the timing, man. Finally, I had to reverse that. Alright, let's let let's let uh, Natalia get some rest in here, cause like we needed it. What's funny is it looks like Nat and the Miz are matching more than Natalia, or sorry, more than um, Maurice and Miz. Got him. So now the women are going to go one on one. Ooh, mm. Kick to the gut. Ooh, brutal form. Boo. They fixed the rope breaks though. Before, like sometimes you wouldn't be able to. You had to really get get away from them. I know. I know what hers are, but I just want to confirm. Um. Natty by nature, sharpshooter. Yeah, she's all sharpshooter. That's the downside. Damn it. That didn't work. Veteran confidence and mind games on display from Natalia. Ref. Oh my god, man, it's so annoying. The, the setup. She dodged that one nicely. Not taking the knee. Maurice is being stopped. I don't know. It looks like Miz might be up again, though. Put in the sharpshooter. Family legacy lives on. Sharpshooter applied. You feel like look at this. Oh, she releases the hold. Why? It's a little surprising, no? Natalia thinking she can close this one out. Why did she release it? 
It might have had something to do with Miz. There you go. Let's go. Miz couldn't get in in time. She was too hurt. And that's it. Scores the win for the team. That's what I'm talking about. Here are your winners. Daddy, Dan, Q, and Natalia. <laughs> what the hell? What the hell? <laughs> What's going on? But these two performed like they're born to be a tag team. Dude, I think Tyson Kidd's going to have a problem with that. What the hell was that, bro? Oh, my God. That looked awkward, too, I have to say. Oh, well. <laughs> That's really funny. Wait, did he say his ball? My balls are massive. That's hilarious. On nothing. That win was completely meaningless. What matters is that I still have an icy title shot. Care to make it French rules? Oh God, bro. Here we go. What does that even mean? It's the highest form of unpredictable surprise-based sports entertainment. A proper cage match with escape-only rules. Are you intercontinental enough to handle it? Call it whatever you want, Miz. It's clearly just a pathetic attempt to find an advantage that you will desperately need. Bad news, though? I'm keeping this intercontinental title no matter what fake French surprise you have planned. Bad news? No way! I'm clearly in your head, which is the best news. Say au revoir to your championship. Give me a sec, guys. Uh, I'll go to the match. Okay. The following contest is a steel cage match. That is for the WWE. Extreme rules, though. I like how they kind of follow the calendar to a degree. All right, you guys, since we hit 450 members, we officially have the new emote. So go ahead and use it at your disposal to all members. Let's go. Introducing the. Ladies and gentlemen, get ready for the dramatic conclusion of the head spinning saga between the defending Intercontinental Champion and the Miz. That's right, Michael. The Rock will defend his Intercontinental title against the Miz in a French Rules cage match. You know what, guys? I was afraid it was going to get to this point. Uh, that's not the new one, Mac. You might have to refresh your chat. There you go. Was it? Move from the I don't really know what happened. Is nearly catastrophic. And that was taking the attack to the competition with that one. Wow. Oh, round and round we go. Tilt the world head scissors. Oh. All right, that's it. Oh, Swanton. Standing shooting star press. Incredible. The challenger eating up some damage. I don't want to call for the door. The added pressure of the steel cage may be getting to it. Vicious right forward. That's such a dumb rule. It's like, just go over the top. I've never liked that. It's like... Well, it might be new to you, bro, but... I mean... The high one's been available for weeks now. The new one is scared. That's the new emote. Oh, we're going a little old school here. Arm drag. Oh, swan time. Carefully placed stop. That Mizzy is getting his grapes. The challenger not looking good right now. The steel cage is just as punishing as your opponent. Momentum on the side of the lock. The locks 
showing that edge, that ruthlessness. Ooh, oh, kick. Nasty kick. Pinning down their opponent's arm. Vicious knee drop. Connects on I got to spam moves. The yeah, I don't like this one. He was elusive there. Vicious right forward. And he's able to reverse. He's positioning himself. Closing in. What a hurricane. Fantastic. You can see as he rises how vulnerable of a position he's in. Looks like the champ is going to retain. Okay. Yeah. Gotta wonder if the stamina is there to make it all the way. Got to phase two. There he is at the top of the cage. Still with a long way to go. He's working toward making his escape. I'm he gone. Taste the win in this cage match. He just has to swing that leg. Got it, and the champ adds to their legacy. Let's get it. Here is your winner, and still. And then they put me back in there. Intercontinental champion, Daddy. This makes your Intercontinental title reign a lot longer. As always, Cole, you're more polite than I am, so I'll just say what we're all thinking. This That's a good point. As as it gets. I think they look at it like it's been a year, but I don't know. I could be wrong. Daddy. <laughs> it's so good. Dan Q. Daddy. You don't get that many, but now we have an upgrade. So I'm going to... There still is one more in this... Uh, so yeah, I definitely like how organized they are in this game. Compared to last time. So I can actually get my aerial running up. Or I can get my... I don't know if I should boost my defense. I could actually do defense and resilience. Oh, no, wait. No, no, I can't. Sorry. Um... I might boost my grappling. See the story progress. Yeah, see. Ollie's well that ends well. And then Dream Big is apparently available. So this Dream Big one might actually be in, in the DMs. It might be in here. Yes, it is. It's actually fought off Mike the Miz in a French rules cage match. And still. Maybe Dan may be the Intercontinental Champ, and he'll never be the GOAT of French-style wrestling, which the French call Le GOAT, by the way. Oui, oui, mon amour. Au revoir, losers. Hopefully for a long time. God, that's so cringe that she's pretending to be French. They're not French, bro. Jesus Christ. And you know what's funny? The French don't like French Canadians. It's just fact. Anyway. Was just rewatching Danky 8000, Mike the Miz of the French Rules Classic. Got me thinking. Anybody else curious how Dan would fare against the actual greatest French wrestler of all time, Under the Giant? Under the Giant? I'd handle my business the same way. Careful what you wish for. Just posted that he'd eat your tiny little legs as hors d'oeuvres before I swallowed you whole. Under the Giant just posted. Um, maybe you should lay off social media for some rest. That way you can recharge your batteries in a literal dream match. Oh my god. We're going to do a dream match. So it's going to be one of those ones where we just have a 1v1 against like a. You know, so we're gonna be we're gonna be basically sleeping, but we're gonna be fighting. It's like a what if scenario with Andre the Giant. These are cool. They're completely unnecessary, but they're pretty cool. Daddy. Sorry. Take a good look at the new face of WWE. It's the lock. The following contest is a steel cage. It's very strange. Oh, it's a cage match as well. So this one's going to be interesting. And they always put this, like, film grain on it, you know? This is healed Andre, though. Hey, what up, Steph? Boy, do we have a 
gigantic match for you tonight. It's the Intercontinental Champion against the incomparable Andre the Giant. Ow. French rules cage match. A gigantic. God damn, Andre he's blocking Giant everything. Match. Come on, Cole. We're in a dream. Think outside the cage. Wait, we're in a dream? That means I can finally get you to hug me, Corey. It's a dream, not a nightmare, Saxton. Big time neck breaker. Bigger they are, the harder they fall, though, guys. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Right to the face. My God. And the pressure on Andre continues to mount. Yeah, Andre needs to find an opening fast. Oh, man. Right to the arm. Hyper extend your elbow. One and Swanton finds the mark. Andre the Giant on the defensive here. He's a climb, climb, climb. He can handle the intensity of this steel cage match. From the heavens, big time splash. Ooh, oh, what a kick. I don't know if I can grab it. We'll try. Oh, he got out of that. He deflects it right back. There's some power behind that punch. The superstar using I tried to reverse. I'm surprised I didn't get that reversal. What up, James? Doing good, are you? Saying that there is a certain disdain for your opponent when you pull off something like that. Is this the right time? Is this the right moment? Oh, oh no! Ooh. Tried to escape the cage. That crunch sound is absolutely brutal. He's getting pushed down into the defensive. Yeah, this has been grueling. The story of this cage match is getting written on these competitors' bodies. Nicely done. What a move! Lock launching attacks left and right. Yeah, Lock is proving hard to keep up with. And that was an efficient display of offense with that maneuver. Oh, right to the kidneys. That was a hell of a maneuver there, guys. Oh, he reversed. It was only a matter of time. I just lost that. If you work those legs. Oh, he reversed it. Come on, wake up. Oh, he got me again. Okay, I gotta give him the spear, baby. Shawn Michaels in this. Getting ever so close to the very peak of the steel cage. And he's finally up to the top of the cage. And as he continues to climb the side of the cage, you have to think his confidence is starting. I'm out. As soon as you get the button, second set of buttons pressed, you won. Well, he is in my rise. I've already encountered him. All right, that's just a what-if scenario kind of a match. All right, guys, well, we are almost done. Um, the side missions for this first chapter. The Sami Zayn storyline, if you will. Okay, and there's still this one, and then I think there's one more after. So let me just go to... Uh, new dms so i figured out what happened you misread that fan's post Andre the giant wasn't posting it was some guy named andrew the gym rat <laughs> andrew the gym rat that makes more sense and by more sense i mean any sense at all yeah you hadn't really been sleeping enough huh guess not and just to clarify this gym rat person wants to eat my legs 
Apparently, yes. And I will say, based on his social media profile pic, he's a very, very large man. Let's keep an eye out next time at the gym. You do that. All right, so nothing there. We will quickly go look at the story progress. So, yeah, we just have this one. Then know your role. That's a satisfying uh, sight right there. See a swift? Didn't get enough. We'll have to wait. But it's still early. Don't forget. So, all right, let's go talk to Ali here. As someone who knows a thing or two about growing pains in WWE, can I give you some advice? Go for it. Three words. Ignore the haters. So, you've seen Cameron Grimes and Happy Corbin chirping at me on social media. Chirper's gonna chirp. And they sure as heck chirped at me during my retribution days. You just gotta tune out the noise. Trust me. Oh, I don't trust anybody around here yet, but thanks for the tip. Hey, I get it. I didn't come up through the PC either. I know what it's like to feel like an outsider here. And I definitely know what it's like to find yourself in a costume you didn't pick. Doesn't mean you can't make it work for you. I can help you find your footing, if you're interested. What's in it for you? Never hurts to have friends, even for us outsiders. How about it? At this rate, a little guidance couldn't hurt. I'm in. What's my next move? You're already an IC champ, but you don't find your voice in WWE by winning titles. You do it by sending strong messages, which is why you need to silence the voices calling you out. I hear you loud and clear. And so will Cameron Grimes. All right, next story. Like, doing each one of these is going to be worth it if we want to max out our superstar as well. But if it's not even going to take us that long, I mean, we'll see. I have a feeling this, based on that, this is going to be a shorter storyline than the first, than the last game. Hey, Grimes, I see you taking, taking shots at my look, but who are you to talk? You look like a steampunk Chippendale. Okay, at least I didn't just invent a dumb persona thin air. This is, this is actually who I am. Yikes, for real? Hop in and knock some fashion sense into you in a match if you're not afraid of popping a button on your vest. Lock it in, lock. Only new fashion I plan to plan on wearing is your IC title, unless you're too scared to put it on the line. First good idea you've had. See in the ring. Everyone always just wants the title, and you're just like, you know what, bitch? There's the door. So I'm wondering if we even do NXT in this. I wonder if there's going to be something that'll send us back to the development section, because we're already on Raw in our first section. You know, it's been a lot of hype. That happens a lot. Prime time. Nuts. Things have gotten personal between the Lock and Cameron Grimes, but it's all business tonight with the Intercontinental Championship on the line. The IC champ has certainly been thrown into the deep end right out of the gate here in WWE. Time to see if he sinks or swims. I think he's been spending too much time worrying about what people are saying on social media. It could end up costing him his title here tonight. Agility like that, easier said than done, gentlemen. Look at the range. Out of the way in time. Nicely done. Wait, does that? Oh, I think he was out of the ring. He's stunned. Go. Now nah, there's a springboard into a moonsault. You gotta get into a moonsault. <laughs> Just a devil may care attitude on full display. Going for broke and it pays off. Watch out. They're coming towards the announcement. Oh man. Alright, all you did was grab me. Throw me in. Get up. Good timing. And Grimes is being controlled here. A killer instinct from the lock is shining through. Boom! Picking up speed. Oh, what a reversal. Yeah, I think I might throw him through the table. Yeah, I was thinking about that. But I gotta get that finisher first. Oh, what wrong button? Shit, my bad. That was a really weird. Not a very effective pin attempt. Big forearm. Oh, my timing is shit. Take him straight to the... Don't finish that phrase, 
Saxton. Cannon will be detoured to Uranus if he doesn't refocus. What was that? Was that supposed to be my comeback move? Come on, baby. The challenger is not letting them know out here. And hanging tough, but beginning to show some wear and tear. Might want to think about picking up the pace a bit. Sling blade. He's getting up, but there's danger in front of him. They changed it, didn't they? Oh, whoa! I gotta, I gotta leave. Look at the look on his opponent's face, Cole. He can't believe it. All right, this is good. Actually, this is where I wanted to go. Here we go, guys. He's going through this table. Did they make? Oh yes, it is a top rope move. They gave me a top top rope move. Let's go. We're going up. Let's fly. There's not enough high. Oh! Okay, get the pin. That might be enough. We'll see. That's all she wrote, baby. Man, I... Man, he got sauce. There's no other way of putting it. Like... <laughs> oh, man, that's crazy. Wait, wait, wait. You're telling me the lock is the hottest thing in WWE? Just saw his match against Grimes. What did I miss? I could pick his lock with my eyes closed. Bro, did you just see what I did? Thanks, Corbin. So you're saying I'm hottest thing in WWE? Thanks. Haha. <laughs> ha. I think it's just going to continue. You were a little rough around the edges out there, but you got the job done. What do you mean? I just threw him through the nice table. Work. Listen, I know you're showing me the ropes or whatever, but I've already got a mentor. Tavish, right? I used to watch him back in his WCW days. Don't think I ever saw him win too many matches, though. Not sure what he can teach you. I'm going to let that slide this one time. I'm not trying to replace anyone, so just hear me out. <sighs> okay, I'm listening. Take it or leave it, but I teach Corbin a lesson about speaking out of turn. Maybe turn his smile upside down. I'll see what I can do. I don't know, Ali just seems like he's kinda, I don't know, I feel like there's something going on there and he's setting up. Do you know what I mean? Like he's, he's, he's prepping something and it's just not, not where we need it to be. Do you know what I'm saying? Held his first Inter Intercontinental title for 65 days. How long will mine last? Well, I feel like it's been longer than that. The phone is the future. So I feel like these optional missions on the side are... Um... He's in... Wait, is he in that shirt for real? dangerous... Last time we faced Corbin was in an optional mission where we lost. There was a challenge. Oh, shit. I almost lost. Dude's wrestling in a button shirt. Like he's on vacation. He's not even doing me the courtesy of... Of, like, you know, changing into his wrestling attire. What happened there? What? 
That was avoidable. With the title on the line. Not much behind that pin attempt. Clearly not enough damage done. Ooh, jarring back elbow. The challenger's looking shaken. If he can hold the line here, he'll be in a good position. Such a dumb one. I don't... It's... One of the ones your boy has to change. You can see as he rises how vulnerable of a position he's in. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. Sorry, wrong button. He just barely dodges. Oh my God! DDT spiked them. He's going for it all. Come on, come on, come on. I hate the spin around. You gotta be kidding me. Take it out from high above. You gotta be some special kind of crazy to do that. Corey gets out of the way in time. No, no, what could this be? Oh, don't do this. Hung up in the barricade. In a big boom. And Corbin can't find a way off the blocks. The lock isn't holding anything back. It doesn't make sense with the trajectory. Just one step ahead. Into the corner he goes. Uh -oh. A perfectly placed target. Someone's helping me out. Looks like Mustafa Ali has more than just advice to offer the lock. All it is is a distraction. I never understood this. You can certainly make sure a match goes your way. He can't allow himself to walk now. And well timed maneuver there. Oh, stomping away. Oh, he's slow time. He saw it coming. Slim blade. Go oh, right to the kidneys. Oh, the challenger's hopes are so. Alright, let's put him away. There is no way this can go on for much longer. Oh, Hopefully he's far I don't know if he's far enough for the ropes. Yeah, that's over. He didn't think to reach his hand up and grab the ropes. Here is your winner. Okay, I'm trying to put keep it in my mind to turn off ring entrance because it just slows down the everything so much, you know. Only reason Dan is still as a title is because Ali showed up to do the heavy lifting. What a clown show! How is that heavy lifting? Dude was just barely there. Okay. Options, entrance off. There you go. Save some time. Usually th these optional ones come Let in threes. Let Corbin keep talking. Just focus on you. Little hard to focus on me when I've got glory hogs crashing my matches to piggyback on my momentum. You realize I bailed you out in that match. I would have right? won without you. You could have lost your title if I hadn't. That's bullshit. I, I appreciate know. your help, but fight your own fights. Man, you need to lighten up. What's it going to take to make you believe I'm actually trying to help you? For starters, you could let me know when you're thinking of running in on my matches. I'll do you one better. Let's fight Grimes and Corbin together. What do you think? I mean, if I must, then I must. I'm not looking for a tag team partner. Me neither. But I've been wanting to shut them up for a while now. You got a problem with us handling some mutually beneficial business? Nope. Just happy you're finally admitting the truth. That this never had anything to do with me. Believe whatever you want. Just bring your A-game. Alright guys, this will probably finish up the storyline for this. But this time we don't have to worry about changing the lock and Mustafa Ali have who's in. Some sort of partnership and they'll put their bond to the That's, test. I always try to Corbin and Cameron Grimes. Since when does an inner trying to avoid that this time? Defending himself against a couple of schoolyard bullies. I hate to agree with Corey, but it makes you want he's got the shoulders down. And there's the kick out. He was really looking for a quick pinfall there. Ah, oh, 
hate that one. Every time they sit up, it's an easy reversal up front. That's why I try to avoid it. Oh, I'm out on Grimes. Get in the ring, or should I just wait him out? And Ali avoids the attack. Taking a moment to let the crowd know how much he appreciates them. Big forearm. Dude, count him out. Seven. It's been way more than seven. Referees count. Jesus. On, gotta get back in the ring. Oh my gosh, a follow-up moonsault slam. Ridiculous standing shooting star. It takes a certain level of athleticism to pull that off. Talks with the arm drag. Yes, tag. Oh my god. Oh, he got out of the way. Really? Doubt. Raising the arm before one. Gonna take a lot more than that to keep this man down. And some effective offense without one. Forearm club. Big blow could be felt throughout the arena. Oh, it's Happy Corbin. I see. That's his. That's his shtick. Sorry, I didn't see it at first. Nicely done. And Corbin is being handled here. A killer instinct from the lock is shining. Oh, this one again? It's too slow. I got out of it. That one's dirty. I love that reversal. You dumbass. Is sick. Trying to find his bearings, but it looks like his end is near. Is it enough for the lock? Big need to Oh man. Finally creates some more offense. He's down, he jumps down for some reason. An impressive kick out by Cameron Rhymes, who's showing a lot of fight this morning. Damn it, he's reversing everything. That's so annoying. It's not enough time. He's done. He took too long. I honestly, that just proved I didn't need Ali's help. I have that feeling too, Christian. I just feel he just seems to like, I don't know. 
There's just something off about the whole thing. Mustafa Ali. I feel like his name should be Ali Mustafa. You know what I mean? I think that's better than Mustafa Ali. I don't know. I don't think it's very similar, obviously, but... No, that's the story. That's that, that that's it. That's the end of the story. <laughs> All right, John's seen enough. Win or lose, uh, can I say I think Dan's chain looks pretty darn good. <laughs> Thanks, Cena. You're our cover star today. I agree with you, John. As far as debut personas go, let's got let's got the ringmaster. Lo oh, Locke's got the ringmaster beat by a country mile. That means a lot coming from Steve Austin. Stone Cold. I'm appealing this and my IC title loss. How is anyone supposed to get a fair match around here with Dan's illegal guardian getting involved? Not so much as dumb gear distracting the refs. Injustice. Appeal denied. All right, the DMs. That was fun. Only more of that to come if you stay focused on your own path and also keep ignoring the haters on social media. I thought that was going to turn into something else. Easier said than posted, but I think I can manage that. All right. No stories. If we go to our current story progress, we just have the know your role, and then there's going to be walk of shame. So we're almost done this chapter, guys. Making great time. Or making good progress, I should say. All right, we have enough to boost. Maybe I should boost my grappling. Get that up. It's actually cheaper to get this to a 7 than this. Oh, no, it's the same, isn't it? They're both even right now. I'll get my grappling up. Oops. So you can actually look into it. I forgot they had actually changed that, didn't they? 88 overall is pretty good, though. All right, next story. Let's go. Hey, champ. I've been meaning to talk to you about a potential big opportunity. Is now a good time? Yeah, sure. What's going on? So far, you've been living up to the office's expectations. But now it's time for a big test. We want the lock to headline a live event for the first time, defending the Intercontinental Championship. Have you been, are you blind there? A live event? I'm not sure that's a big test. I've already done that. Let me finish. The live events in one of our top markets, LA. But there's always a lot of competition for the WWE Universe's entertainment dollar. It takes a big name talent to put butts and seats there. You know, like when I main evented WrestleMania 12. Wasn't that in Anaheim? Technically not LA. Nothing gets by you. Anyway, if you can sell out a major arena in LA, you can do it anywhere. Even Anaheim. So what do you think? I think I'm more than ready. Let's make it happen. Great. We thought we'd let you choose who you want a main event against. Sami Zayn, Ridge Holland, Austin Theory. We can just promote your appearance without an opponent. I wouldn't mind smacking around Sami Zayn for old time's sake. Tried and true. I'll make it happen. Might as well. It says know your role, so I'm just kind of wondering if, like, The Rock's going to be in here. I mean, they can make them say whatever they want. They can make them tweet anything. I mean, obviously. So, big live event coming up. Do you feel extra pressure knowing that same night The Rock will be in L.A. promoting the premiere of his new movie, Mudslide? I don't know why they didn't call it Rock Slide. It was right there. That's news to me. And to be honest, that does raise the stakes a bit. The Rock's a huge deal, obviously. But I think there's room for both of us to succeed that night. Or at least I hope so. I should mention that it's not just a typical movie premiere. Rock's giving away a hundred brand new pickup trucks and anyone who attends is eligible to win. I heard fans were lining up weeks in advance. Look, it's gonna be fine, okay? When the bell rings for my match, those seats will be full. Got it. Oh, and just a heads up, I might be a little late to the show on account of the fact I need to cover a friend's shift waiting in line for a truck at Rock's premiere. But I'll try my best to catch your match, too. <laughs> Got it. Thanks. It's so dumb, because honestly, Rock's movies are different... They're a different audience. People in the wrestling community aren't going to choose The Rock's films over wrestling. They already are wrestling fans. Because when you look at Rock's movies, they're they're okay. Like, they're not bad movies, but they're not like they're blockbuster hits most of the time. Like, think of the last truly great movie he made, or he was in. Because he's typecast as the same guy every time, right?
I love it when they taunt like that and like I'm not hurt enough. Oh! What the hell happened there? I attacked first. Oh, I missed it. I hate when they put it at the bottom because I'm always looking at the top. Damn it. I tried to get up early and it bit me in the ass. Dude, I'm reversing these. Finally. Honestly, I didn't sell it out. Look at all the empty seats. But I think that's part of their... I think that's part of the idea. It's like, oh, he, look, he didn't sell out one of these live events. These are, I'm assuming they're talking about a house show, right? That's a reversal. Don't worry, Joel. That's all what we're going to be playing pretty much this whole week, next week as well. I mean, depending how how long how long it takes to get through. Did I miss? Oh, that's bullshit. I only missed because I, well. I don't like this move. I wish it was just like a spear or a power bomb. I gotta change it. I don't get why the uh, takeover is happening. The comeback is here. Oh, he reversed that. He needed to do that badly. I love that move. There you go. He didn't get around that. I think Sammy's toast. There you go. Easy money. Here is your winner. And still, WWE hits Didn't really give me much of a story there, but that could just be the start of it. So, how'd it go out there? The match went fine, but in case you didn't notice, the arena was only half full. So, not great. What do you chalk that up to? 
I thought facing Sammy would be a match people wanted to see, but maybe they were tired of it and wanted something new. Or maybe it's just tough to compete with The Rock giving out free trucks. Who knows? I mean, 100 trucks is uh, sounds like a lot on paper when you compare to how many people are showing up. So if I had picked... so Would that have changed things if I had picked something else? What a successful LA premiere event for my amazing new movie, Mudslide. Her traffic was backed up for miles and so many fans trying to get one of those brand new shiny free trucks. Appreciate the love as always. The next time, schedule your big premiere giveaway on a night when WWE isn't in town. I'm sorry, who the hell is this? I'm the lock. You know, the current Intercontinental champ. Main event of tonight's show that was destined to follow up going against you and get your giveaway. Hold up. Did you say the lock? I'm a busy guy. I can't, it, can't read it fast enough. Decision branches. I didn't get a chance to read it. That's so annoying. So it didn't go well tonight for the Intercontinental Champion. You're hyped up is the next big thing. Now I get the nickname, sort of. Yeah, I was hyped like that. And I had the pr added pressure of being first ever third gen superstar. Bumps in the road. I had a bad haircut and fancy chanting, die, Rocky, die. I remember that. But I overcame all that. I don't know a lot about you, but I had one bad night. You can overcome this too. Thanks for the advice. Everything you've accomplished. So thanks for not only responding to me, but taking the time. I need a busy schedule to give some advice. It means a lot. Anytime. I'm sorry my movie premiere ruined your headline opportunity. I owe you one, okay? Free, free tickets. Sure, that sound, that'd be great. I'm asking you. Something bigger than that, but don't sleep on the movie, okay? I won't. Thanks again. Like, I'll be watching. I mean, probably not because I'm super busy, but you know what I mean. Yeah. Okay, so we didn't miss much there. Hey, come find me on the next round. I need to talk to you about something. Let me guess. Now I have to relinquish the title because I didn't do well enough for him. It's so dumb. All right. Man, look at this stuff in the background. That old, that, 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 that like, skateboard and... Wait, do I have anything new? I have 10. It's not really enough to do. I can do submission. That's it. Socials are chirping. Next coming out, WWE Live Los Angeles. We'll be back to Bigger Show next time. Someone's going to reply and say, well, Let's come to the next PWJ show in LA. Promise my match will be way better than whatever trash damage you th sit through. The most, the biggest, baddest, dirtiest movie of the year. Mudslide out now in theaters everywhere. Okay. Ah, oh, there's a story there. All right, good. It's I can do it. Okay, so it's probably this. I have to do this before we finish it. Read the reports online. Read the reports online. The LA event was half full. If you think that was bad, you should have seen some of the crowds we had back in WCW. And this tickets were free. Keep your head up. All right, Ziggles. Hey, buddy, saw you bomb pretty hard headlining your first live event in L.A. If you're interested in turning their box office prospects around, just holler. I know a thing or two about making it. All right, so this is our last optional mission before we finish off the final main. We certainly know a thing or two about bombing. Hey, I'm just trying to help. No need for the low blow. I'm sure you have no ulterior motives whatsoever. What up, Derek? I don't. I just want my fellow superstars with movie star good looks and charisma to thrive on as many platforms as possible. So what, they can eventually hire me to be their co-star? Is that an ulterior motive? Fair. How about this? You and I score off one-on-one -on, -one on Raw and non-title. If you win, I'll leave you alone. But if I win, you let me guide you, overcome your box office bomb, and become Hollywood's next breakout superstar. Like The Rock or even The Miz. What do you say? See you in the ring. Let's get it. The Walk of Shame. So, is this going to be... Like, some of them are only one match events. Some of them are three. So, it's, like, hard to say. But we're on the cusp of finishing the very first chapter. What's up, BC Dub? How you doing? Dolph Ziggler seems intent on flexing his veteran experience on the new Intercontinental Champion. He's certainly not wasting any time. Saxton's usually the gossip. Ziggs is fun to watch. Backstage rumblings that Dolph actually made a play at mentoring the rookie. Seems to me like Dolph's the one that could use the mentoring. The Locks already an Intercontinental Champion. Oh, a strong impact. Oh, there's the old. Oh, that hurt. The old, oh, that hurt. Standing shooting star press, incredible. And just like that, we kick the tempo up a notch. Oh, oh, right suplex. 
Down on the jaw. You can bite your tongue with that. Caught in a bad position here. See ya. Ooh, that was on the side. That is tossing your own body around without a care. Taking no account for your own well-being. Enough already. Squaring off right by our announce table. Ooh, that hurt right to the kidney. Golly. not bad so far i like how much more organized this game is compared to the last one so you know that you're doing missions like in the last one it was hard to say see that's my move but the way the momentum works it doesn't make sense so i might have to change that uh-oh who's coming in i mean it's got to be are you serious? Oh, it's the Miz, what is of the course. Miz doing out here? Oh, he probably noticed it'd been an hour since he saw oh, sorry. his face on the TV screen. Ignore it, ignore it. He's gonna hit me with the finisher. I gotta reverse this. Zigzag, watch the zigzag. Got it. Oh, the lock manages the counter. Oh, swat time. Avoiding contact. Oh, clothesline. He is just reeling from that offense. Yeah, but you can't count anyone out. Oh, he got out of that. Somehow I missed him. Either way. Saw that one coming. Oh, what is this? Ignore him. The Miz is getting involved. Picking up speed. Oh, I was too slow? Are you serious? Man, I hate that. Sometimes you're just way too slow. Drops the hammer right on the lower back. He's positioning himself, closing in. His superstar is digging down deep. His superstar giving themselves a oh, I didn't get it in time. He's going for the cover. Quick shoulder up. It's unthinkable. Someone beating the one count at this point. And the gear finds its mark. Oh man, he is fine. I got my her up hours, bitch. Ooh. Standing shooting star press incredible. Ooh. Just like that. Dolph dodges away. You can use items, you just can't attack with them. So I can pick take that. I can take that chair and wedge it and throw him into it. That's a dub. Here is your winner, Daddy. Why is the Miz coming out? Just because he was mentioned? He was name dropped? And they're trying to be like, oh, you know. I don't know. Daddy. <laughs> Missed the opportunity not having that uh that announcement in there. That was the best way of announcing it. No, you can't. I'm, I'm assuming you have to beat the story and then you can use your gear. I just think of my big casting surprise. I I, will, I think I beat you, so I have, you have to leave me alone. You have to beat me in a one-on-one, -on -one, but nobody said anything about Miz running. Totally different script, but if you and a partner can beat Miz and I in a tag match, I'll drop the whole Hollywood mentorship thing for good. How about it? I'll pass. I don't have time for this Hollywood nonsense. Isn't there a game show you should be auditioning for or something? Uh oh, I think maybe Dan doesn't have anyone to co-star with. So sad. I thought we were working on a comedy. It turns out it's a tragedy. I think you're right, Miz. Another one-man show that won't last. What a pity. You know what? You're both on. I'll make it work. And if I win, no more sequels. All right, well, who am I? Who do I get to pick? Oh, my boy Gabe. Gabe Slade. You wanted to chat about Dolph Ziggler and the Miz? Are they friends of yours now? Not at all. More like the opposite. I need a little help getting them off my back and out of my social media feed. You down for a tag match? Tall order with those two, but count me in. Cool. You're welcome. Yeah, we do never thank him. It's kind of messed up. I will say, though, uh, Miz and Ziggler are probably two, two of some of the best um, heels in the business. They just play the bad guy so well. And, like, 
You know what I mean? That's why people end up actually loving them just because they, you know, they're so good at being a douche. I think the Miz, they both had their face times, but they spent most of the time in the heel because it's just suited to them better. Slade will have their hands full against the always unpredictable Dolph and his Hollywood co-star Miz Bye. in this tag team throwdown. Hopefully this sequel's back. Springboard! Oh, what the hell I clipped through. That was playing with fire and getting burned. The decision to take such a risk at this juncture is questionable. What are you talking about, big player? Oh, I missed! A completely ill-advised decision. Likely gonna pay for it in the rest of this match. Hope you boys put your running shoes on. It might be time to clear out. And Tagiri finds its mark. Vicious right forward. Oh, what a coming blow. Stomping down. Four. Oh, he got out of it. All that training's paying off. He creates space with his legs. Damn. This is all glitched out. Let's get inside. He needs to find his way back into the ring. I have to win by pinfall or submission, not a count out. It's incredible the inventiveness we are seeing on this. Let's get it. Oh, he reversed it. Really? Way too early. I was actually gonna go for a tag, like a double team. Go behind. Those ones I keep mistiming. Lives to fight another day. Ziggler sending his opponent a clear signal. He doesn't think they can hang. That could be it. Ziggler sending me a Ziggler. <laughs> I'm just trying to reverse, but it's not happening. This match ah. him down a no! Face first. He's got it. Oh, ho, ho. let's get it on. Oh god, that's bad. Too early. Neck breaker. He's just got these big power attacks. It's wild. Is Dolph from Cleveland as well? Okay, I'm going to go ahead and say no on that. I thought Miz or... Yeah, yeah. Sorry, I was thinking of... Never mind, yeah. See, why? It missed for no reason. That happens a lot. Unfortunately, a lot of the issues that are that plagued the last few games are also plaguing this. Oh, he gave me a swinging neck breaker. That's just disrespectful. Yeah, this tracks. Miz never did meet a crowd he didn't know how to play to. Oh. Oh, the close line. Forcefully delivered. And now, oh my God, what a fall! Type of job. Across the top rope. Very nice. Saw that coming. How the hell did he manage to get a swinging neck breaker like that? Here comes side effect. Damn, the timing is all messed up. Oh, that was just malicious. Just See, Steve, thanks for coming, bro. He's getting a little better now. Uh oh, I gotta reverse this. Maybe not. He's going to me. Nice reversal by me. I can't get up, I'm still just laying down. Precarious position here. Oh man. Sorry guys, I gotta just fix something that changed. I gotta wait for my stun to be over. Nice 
nice takedown. Miz with an awesome awareness. Knew what Gabriel had coming. Quick exchange, reversing the reverse. Oh, I had a finisher. Missed it. Missed it. Sorry, I gotta see. What's my finisher again? Uh, standing behind, standing front. The tag, Dolph Ziggler into the ring. We're about to see. Oh, that is filth! What a move! Oh man, that was a sick finisher, bro. Tag team wrestling. There's a tag. What are we gonna see here? Double team effort. Double shoulder block. And this is good. Um, he's not the legal man, dipshit. Stunned, so I have a second. <laughs> Just work it in the back. See what happens. It's not enough. No, Co Cody Rhodes was a little different. Running Swanton finds the mark. Going for it, come on. Oh man, he is still. Oh, I missed. He may be in a bad way here. These two teams have gone to war, Cole. Ow. Sure, he's popping himself up, but he's Oh, from the back. A chance to recover. Could be some collateral damage on the way here. Everyone needs to clear out, including us. Let's get a buffer. Oh, those are lame as hell. No reversal option. I'm bleeding. I hate that. Damn, this is just going on way too long. What? How did he get into that? I was doing a move. Sure. He might. 
I had to get out with resiliency. My teammate was not coming in. I might have to tag in Gabe. He's in good shape. Uh-oh. That was essential because I was actually going down. Oh, that's bad. I've got to reverse this. I could lose. Uh, yeah, the Latino heat. Into that zone. Two. Hooked up. Oh, what? And he gets set back into the ring. And now thrown back into the ring. Tag made. Tag made. No, it wasn't. What are you talking about? He's been placed in the corner now. Devastating kick. There you go. Let's get Gabe in here. He's in good nick. I'm not, but neither are they. Haha. Let's see if we can go for the pin. I don't think it's enough, but it might have killed his momentum. Yes! He was he used all his energy to try and tag him in. Daddy, Dan, Q, and Gabriel Slade. Gabe Slade is just a jobber, right? They made him for this. Like he's not real, right? They always have a guy who helps you. He's like kind of your homie. But anyway. Alright, Miz has a beef. You said no more sequels. Dude, I thought but what about I thought that was trilogy? number two. Maybe it wasn't. Here we go again. Don't you have a reality series to bore America with? I'm stepping in to handle casting for Dolph, and I just recruited a huge box office draw to be the newest cast member in our superstar ensemble. But I've got to keep him a secret. Classic Hollywood storytelling. Are you up to find out who it is? I told Dolph, and now I'm telling you, I'm not interested in crossing over into Hollywood. How many different ways do I have to say it? Okay, you want to know the truth? Dolph and I are working on a new movie, and the producers are concerned we need a fresh face, up and coming co star. Okay? Are you happy now? We need you. Next time, just come out and say that instead of wasting my time. But it's still. Just oh, hear sorry, me. Sorry, I didn't mean to skip that. I'm going to give you three options, okay? Rule of three. It's a Hollywood thing. You can team up with your boy Gabe one more time to face Dolph, me, and our mystery partner in a two versus three handicap match. You can take on the new mystery man alone in a singles match, or you can take on Dolph and I in a handicap match. If you agree, I'll make sure The Rock, John Cena, and Batista all tune in. I hate tag matches, so I'm going to go with the singles versus the new person. <laughs> For real? Hollywood connections, baby. But if you lose, you have to sign on to do our movie. That's the deal. Take it or leave it. Mystery man singles. Fine. I've seen everything you and Dolph have to offer, so I'll take the mystery, man. I hope it's... Because, yeah, honestly, these tag matches are so long-winded. But they don't actually go that way, right? They're always, like, this. they're predetermined, and we know, you know, who's going where. But... The dramatic conclusion to the Intercontinental Champions rivalry with Dolph Ziggler all comes to a head here tonight. Classic Dolph Ziggler theater of the mind. He won't even be in the match. The IC champ will have to settle things with Dolph's stunt double. Let me ask you this, Saxton. If you can't enjoy the show, they don't really look the same. Pin broke up easily. He's looking to get this match won in short order. Ouch. Bullseye. Why does it do things not even on the ground? LA Knight reminding the WWE universe whose game it is. From the middle rope, fails to hit the bullseye. Not even close to it. Very nice. I've never even heard of this guy. And didn't have an option to reverse it. There's not much room out there. Are you kidding me? Off the apron to the floor. You don't aim for the apron unless you're 
Oh, to do come on, bro. Oh my gosh, what impact. It's starting to piss me this off. This is a warning to grab our stuff and go. Keep it in the ring, please. Saxton's a very fragile boy. Thrown out of ringside and back to the man. Into gear here finds its mark. He's lost some of his win now. Big kick. What a kick. He's got him in deep, deep trouble here. Look out. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Shot guillotine to leg drop. Well, some might call that showing off, but what a display. What a did I miss or did I? Lands the elbow. He moves just in time. Damn. Back of his neck. The degree of difficulty for something like that can't be overstated. He's looking a little off balance. He turns it around. Oh my God. Ridiculous standing shooting star. And the lock has picked up the pace. This can't be. Mash it, mash it, mash it, mash it quick. He's gonna, oh, he'll be able to reverse that. Ooh, I managed to get it. Oh, boy, he's talking him. Watching for an opening. Oh, he reversed it. Why would you say that? Jaw-dropping show of strength this late into the match. And that was an effective attack, guys. You can't take much more of this. And he has just taken an extra oh, amount of abuse. Both superstars showing great awareness of their opponent's repertoire. Knight Another reversal. LA Knight came to the game with BFT. Yikes. Knight stepping an end to this. I'll just kick out. I'm a little risk. Use that resiliency. Absolutely stunned. A display of near superhuman resilience. After seeing that attack, oh, he's got me. Oh, I thought he was going to put me in the tree. Woo! Almost. What's it going to take to keep this guy down? How many of these finishers does he have? That's it. I lost. That's so irritating, bro. I had the dub. So now I got to do the movie. So annoying. I just couldn't reverse it. He had 6,000 finishers for some reason. So he's able to do finisher and then signature, and I had nothing. It's like my momentum. That's where I think my resiliency needs to move up. I wasted my resiliency, I think, too early, but it was kind of a panic mode. But I don't get as many that I would have. I don't think it was. It says attempt to beat him. I honestly don't know. We'll see what the social says. Now it's like we have to do the movie. Hold up, my end of the deal. I got Rock, Batista, and Cena watch your match. And they all loved it. Cena said it was off the chain. Oh, so it doesn't even matter? Never said that, but I did see your match. Keep up the hustle and you'll get more and more respect in WWE Hollywood if you want it. I saw it too, because Miss not because Miss said it. Keep making moves. Hey guys, it's your old buddy Dolph. Got any juicy rolls for me and Miz? Blocked. See, that didn't matter. It really didn't. So we're at the point where we're just going to finish up this storyline. We ha might have enough. I don't know if we do. No. I mean, we have enough to do. You know what? Let's, let's boost the defense. That's fair. Resilience could be good too. Uh, view the details, yeah. So let's see my running. It's all 94. Aerial range is already at 
a level 8, which is pretty much peaked. Because I've already got the, the stats boosted for that, so it's almost like, do you bother spending the money there? Alright, well, hold on, wait, hold on. Before we do anything, let's just confirm. Last one, faction forming. The final mission in this storyline. You wanted to talk, Hey, Walrus, right? how you doing, man? What's up? I've been thinking back on my own career lately, and I realized a lot of my success can be credited to the factions I was a part of, both off-screen and on. Just like you, I was strong-willed and independent. But in WWE, you often find yourself needing backup. The other members of the Click and DX also puts each other to be better. What are you getting at? Two prominent superstars have approached management with the idea of building a faction around you, and the brass thinks it's a good idea. Is this because of the LA Live event? It's not about what happened in LA. I promise, if I get the opportunity to headline again, I'll do everything in my power to make sure it's standing room only. Sure, whatever. But this faction stuff has nothing to do with that. It's all about accelerating your rise to the top. And I think it says a lot that a couple of heavy hitters came to us wanting to build something around you. So I'll say it again. You just need to play ball here and trust the process. Okay, but if I do this, I see it as a good opportunity to freshen up my look. So no more lock gear, okay? If that's what it takes to get this done, then fine. Okay, then I'm on board. So who approached you about this? What are my options? The two superstars who want to recruit you are MVP and Randy Orton. Cool. Go talk to them, hear what they have to say, and decide what's best for your career. All right, let's do it. Enter a story game. Playing will advance the story, and you will unable to return to play any optional storylines you may have not completed. Yeah. So it's a transition uh, over to, like, new content, basically. Or do a new chapter. It's like, if you haven't done it, you're not going to be able to do it again. Oh, that's pretty good so far. It's way more organized. It's easier. They've sorted it better so you can actually do all the missions if you want. You're in high demand as both Randy Orton and MVP would like to recruit you during their factions. Be sure to talk to both of them about your options before you make this important decision. Uh, yeah, so this is still being... Let's talk to the Ort skis. Glad we could finally talk. Especially since you might be hearing some big promises from guys like MVP. But let's cut to the chase. What has he really accomplished? A lot, actually. He's been a success both inside the ring and outside guiding the Hurt Business. Sounds like MVP's gotten to you already. But I know he's a big talker, which is about all he can do these days. Unlike me. So, why are you getting involved with all this faction stuff? I enjoyed what I had in Arcade Bro, and it got me thinking about my start in WWE, when I was a part of one of the greatest factions Evolution. of all time. Evolution. I want to add to my legacy by building an even better version. Interesting. So, where do I fit in? I'll be the veteran leader. The Triple H type. And I see the lock in the Phenom role that I held. You're not the guy yet, but with my help, you will be. I seem to recall that you and Evolution didn't end on the best terms. You don't need to worry about that. With me in charge, it will be different. And when the time's right, I'll pass the torch to you and you'll become world champion, just like I did. When will that be? I can't make any promises. Ultimately, it's up to you. Ball's in your court now. Let me know what you want to do. This is a huge decision. I need more time to think it over. Fine, but I'm not going to wait around forever. Let Understood. Me... All right, well, let's go talk. I, I figure it's best to hear them both out. Because I want to see what MVP wants to do. Intercontinental champion, the lock. It's a pleasure, man. I've enjoyed watching you tear it up so far on Raw. And they weren't wrong with all that hype, which is why I wanted to talk to you. I'm relaunching the Hurt Business, and I want you to be the centerpiece. 
the new CEO. The last version had issues. I couldn't keep track from one week to the next if you were together, broken up, or who was even in the group. You're not wrong, which is why I am going to do it right this time. And that starts with you. I mean, look at what I did for Bobby Lashley. I helped elevate him to become WWE Champion. And I can do the same thing for you, but faster. Since, let's be honest, Bobby was a bit of a rehabilitation project. But you, you're ready for prime time. So, who else do you have in mind for the group? I'm reviewing a lot of top candidates, but don't worry about that. No matter who else joins, the lock is going to be the guy, the focus of the group. Every decision the Hurt Business makes will be to further your individual success first. That all sounds good. Assuming you're not just saying all this to get me on board. I'm not. Trust me. I see big things in you. So what do you think? You ready to make the best decision of your life? Honestly, I'm less convinced. I still need more time to decide. I totally get it. Think it over and do what's best for you. Hopefully, that means joining my side. I can see how it's different, though, depending. I'll let you know. I think I might join Orton. I like the sound of Orton. Like, he's more honest. He's more upfront, and I'd love to have a little RKO action in the corner. you make up your mind about joining me? Yeah. I'm ready to be a part of evolution. Good. You made the right call. I'm extremely confident in your abilities, but I want to give you a crash course in doing things the evolution way. Meet me at the performance center tomorrow. And don't be late. I mean, the thing is, I could also like do I could do four runs of this, depending how how much people would want to see that. And I could do alt choices, so I can do this, then I can do female. You know, the legend storyline, and then do certain ones, and then switch it up. You know what I mean? There isn't really heal responses, is there? Hit a front-running grapple. Wow, that was a fail. Nail a heavy combo. Why are you pinning me? Well, let me just confirm. For a full list. Uh, let me just confirm. Heavy combo. Oh, just something with a heavy combo in it. I see. It was basically a reversal. Come on, man. Ooh. Oh, he just sidestepped me. Work those legs. Okay, what's next? Quick. If your signature's got any style. Alright, he wants, he wants me to hit my signature move. Sick. He's stunned. He's toast.
I get it. So you can either use your that's your so the blue line is your signature move, but it can also be used as your comeback. Uh, mainly based on what I've seen, there's been a couple of tweaks. Story is different. Joining Evolution feels like a turning point in my career. I mean, everything before this felt big, but now it really seems like I'm on my way to the top. But do you think Randy Orton will be willing to share the spotlight with you? Can you trust him? I was skeptical of all this at first, but I'm trying my best to trust the process. Which is tough, since I know Randy's not always been the most straight-up guy, but I think he really wants to do this the right way. And that means stepping aside when the time's right and giving me the spotlight. It's not really Randy's Any way. Clue who else will be joining this new evolution? Randy hasn't told me anything. I guess we'll all find out together. On your knees, dark. Bow down to the... Bow down to the king. I don't really know. His eyes are kind of loopy, aren't they? They kind of messed up the character models in this one. Like, they try to make changes and they end up, like, Someone's mucking it up. Arriving in style. Any idea who this could be? Shane O'Mac. Sure. As far as I know, all the VIPs are already here. Oh, it's me. What's this all about? We've seen these two team before. Gabe, it was just a what's with the pink thing? suit? Doesn't suit me. The rumors surrounding Randy Orton. This must be the debut of his newly reformed Evolution. Let's go. Led by Orton, Evolution is here on Raw. And they look ready to dominate. I'm having flashbacks. In that pink suit, that powder pink. I don't know about that, bro. Evolution, revolution. The lock, join evolution. So that's okay. That's a separate trophy altogether. So is that it? Is it? Is this the second chapter now? Like it must be, because it's. So there's gonna be a different trophy for joining the hurt. Uh, the hurt, hurt, hurt Huckleberry. The Huckleberry hurt. <laughs> That's the name of it, isn't it? We'll see in a second. All right, let me just take a look. All right, yes, it is. Do the evolution. So it does line up. I, yeah, it does line up to be its own. There's a lot less, though. We'll see what happens. There's a lot less missions in this. Well, looks like there's two. This one had three, right? But all these, all these end up actually being quite long. Like, they have three in their own, so... Uh, we'll find out tomorrow, uh, do the evolution. So making headlines, I want to sort this by chapter. I'd say that's the best way to do it. So anyway, guys, we're going to go ahead and leave this here. We'll come back tomorrow. So don't worry, we'll be back and we'll be doing the evolution <laughs> for this next chapter. And based on this, um, I think like depending how much you guys want it, I think I might end up going like doing alternate decisions, like major decisions uh it does it, you know what i mean so like this time i'll do this and then when i do the legend i'll do one thing then i'll come back to the lock maybe again and just switch it up and be more of an asshole and then and then also just do alternate decisions so like instead of going to evolution go to the hurt business instead so i don't know we'll see how it goes but for now it doesn't seem like you can switch brands unless it's written into the storyline i'm not sure i'm wondering if this one is exclusively a raw story and the other one's a smackdown i don't really know but one's male one's female that's all i know it is predetermined so we are going to find out how it does it i it's not like 2k22 in that regard where you can jump from brand to brand and then you just do different challenges and missions through there there is a set main story that they have for the entire series and then they just kind of go from there so uh yeah Anyway, guys, that's going to be it for this stream. If you did enjoy this first video, make sure you leave a like on it. Comment your thoughts below. And make sure you are subscribed with those post notifications turned on. That's the bell icon so you don't miss anything I put out. Uh, be sure to like and follow my socials as well. I've got Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat, and Discord linked in the description. If you want to get a shirt hoodie of mine, link in the description. Also in a better feature right below the stream. You can scroll down and see some of the goodies I have there. Uh, big shout out to all the sponsors, of course, of the stream. DX Racer, Bones Coffee, Always Bearded, The Ridge Wallet, Matter Rabbit Tattoo, and Jake's Custom Controllers. I use their products every single day. And you can check them out for yourselves. The links in the description. Make sure you using my promo code dank thousand to save at checkout finally guys be sure to sign up and check out the team 8000 membership program if you haven't done so already it does support the page a lot there's four tiers available entry basic premium and ultimate all four of those tiers have a wide variety of perks 
Obviously, the higher up the list you go, the better and more perks you're going to get for signing up. But that entry level is only 99 cents, so it's super cheap and easy to get into the program. Uh, you'll get things like custom badges, bright name, custom emojis to use in chat, exclusive video and stream access, party open lobbies, giveaways, discounts, and plenty more. Guys, we had hit 450 members today. Massive jump, 72 total members in today's stream. So that is awesome. So we got a new emoji. You guys can use it right now. I actually got it designed while we were streaming. I'm multitasking beast, apparently. Not always. That's actually very ironic because I'm usually not. Um, so let's work towards 500. That's our next major milestone where I can give you another emote. And obviously, 500 milestone, that's a pretty massive number for us. So let's keep that going. So consider joining that. Link in the description. Join button is below the video and on my main channel page as well. And you can also, like I said, gift memberships to other people uh, right next to the... Uh, chat bar there's a dollar sign icon and from there you can choose have the option to gift members to people anywhere from 1 to 50 members at a time and you can gift those memberships if you're on desktop or if you're on android phone currently iphone is being worked on they don't have it ready yet but hopefully they'll have that ready soon anyway guys cannot wait to continue this uh my rise career of the lock hopefully we do see you tomorrow but like I said, pretty much for the next two weeks, it's going to be 2K My Rise and maybe Showcase Mode. We're just going to try and do as many things as we possibly can this week. So don't go too far. We will be back tomorrow, same time, same place, to continue the lock storyline in WW2K23 My Rise and do the evolution chapter, chapter number two. Guys, thank you again. Have a great rest of your day, and I hope I see you tomorrow. Thanks again, guys. Take care. Peace.